Good afternoon, Internet Denizens. It is I, Hamster of Wrath. I hope you're doing very well, as I'm grabbing for my audio sources, as usual. Uh, we already have some lovely people in chat already, Heresy. Yes, that's very heretical, sorry. <laughs> we have the Roach Mogul and Math877N. I hope you're both doing very well. Uh, I am a little bit sleepy after uh, yesterday. Yesterday was kind of uh, yesterday night was kind of bonkers, um, and I didn't sleep too well. So you know, perfect, perfect brain, brain stuff for uh, Stellaris. But there we go. Uh, hey, I'm Pim, Pim, boy. How's it going? Grab your caffeine source as well. Hey, Quinlist. Welcome, welcome. No, I'm easing off the caffeine a little bit, honestly. I'm only allowing myself one caffeinated beverage today, and it's literally for the stream. So you know. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, honestly, I think I probably set the difficulty settings for this relatively low. I legit can't remember. It was something like 30 hours ago in game, so I can't bloody remember what the hell I set. So there we go. Um, no, I didn't sleep brilliant. Didn't sleep brilliant, but this is fine. Yeah, exactly. I was on. I was on cadet. Yeah. So this is. This is. <laughs> I am not a ninja at this game. I was still figuring out what the hell to do. So there we go. Uh, if it's just one, might as well be death wish. Death wish? Is that a drink? That sounds like something you wouldn't want to drink. Have a nice cup of death wish. Uh, it doesn't sound like a great idea, does it? Oh god! I bet you that's something horrific. Some horrific energy drink. Right, this construction ship is doing nothing, but apparently there's nothing for it to do either, so that works. Uh, same with that chap. Okay, we've got some construction ships if I need them. Uh, that science ship is doing absolutely nothing, I don't know. Go, go do things, science ship. Uh, I prefer Ensign difficulty, because it doesn't give any bonuses to the AI. Ah, uh, okay. I assume Ensign's one above Cadet. That would make sense, wouldn't it? Um, okay, let's check in on our colonies. I don't think we have any major problems with our colonies at the moment, because I think I addressed that most of that last time. Uh, so I think we're kind of kind of doing okay. Death Wish has 650... Okay, I know for a fact that a can of monster has 50 in it. That is like drinking... That's that's ridiculous. I can't do the maths, but that's a lot of monster. God, that's that that, that, with the, that is literally death wish. That would that could quite easily kill you. That's ridiculous. Okay. Um. Let's. Ooh. Okay. We were going to do an invasion over here. I remember this. We were we were putting things together for an invasion. So we got a uh, not very good invasion fleet there. I think we got some angry robots, haven't we? Yes, we shall send some angry robots as well. Probably take about eight weeks for them to get there. I buy about eight weeks. I actually mean like probably more like years. But uh, there we go. A liquid death is just water. That's <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. If you fall into it and you drink too much of that, you you generally you end up dead as well. Uh, that's a missing science vessel, and they close the borders because they're angry at us. That's perfectly okay. Okay. 100% of people who drink water die. <laughs> because I presume everyone does in the end, let's face it. Beats the game on Grand Admiral. Yeah, I guess it's like, if you want to like really challenge yourself, and, and you're really good at this game and you enjoy that kind of thing, that's cool. I like having fun myself. And I'm glad I didn't put this on any higher difficulty, I'll be honest, because I was, I was pretty lost just on cadet difficulty, so I, I wasn't going to go any higher. We should probably check in on the Senate, actually. What's going on with the Senate? The Senate. The Senate. I mean, except I'm not, but you know. Uh, Grand Admiral AI get a 100% resource output. Ugh, that's foul. No, we don't like that. That sounds terrible. Okay, we have actually, uh, we're still quite high in the old uh, diplomacy weight, so that's good. Okay, um, this is these trait points that keep popping up, and I, I don't know where the Tendrakians are, so I think that's a bug. I think people were mentioning that was a bug the other day, so I'm going to just ignore that for now. Um, I think we're good. I think we're kind of okay. 
Oh yeah, plus 100%. That would make way more sense, yeah. Oh, that was the other thing I was doing. What was I... I had some diplomacy or some espionage or something going on somewhere. Fuck it, I can't remember where. Was it here? Ah, oh, yes, the Zolokako. Uh, we're desperately trying to make friends with them. Actually, no, we're not. We're going to accidentally turn them militant and they've got atomic weapons. Nothing bad could happen there. Absolutely no problems at all. Hey, Shepard, how's it going? Uh, I bought this a week ago and slow start and figure out how you're finding it. Uh, honestly, uh, the first couple of streams were like information overload. And luckily I had some lovely people in chat to guide me through it. Now, I'm kind of feeling like vaguely comfortable with it, but there are still menus inside menus inside menus I'm finding. So uh, hopefully you're getting uh, getting uh, on with it well, Shepard, because uh, yeah, it's got... I can't even remember. Some, there was a menu the other day somebody pointed out to me. Was it was it the, uh, the world type ones? Yeah, I was kind of like, where are we? Here we are. Yeah, th no, not auto, not planet designation. Here we are. Uh, you, you could. Th there's another menu. Look, another menu. Always another menu. So yeah, there's a lot going on. Colony specialization. That would be it in English. You're right. That would be it. Uh, who are this lot? Are we? Are we? Are we spying on these people? The Windar. Windar. Uh, no, we appear to not be spying on them. Oh well, we'll just leave them be for now. I've got enough in my plate. Right, if I've got some spare science ships, there's probably some excavations and things I have not done that I've probably forgotten. Let's have a look-see. Uh, no, is that... Ah, okay, if it's greyed out, that means it's already gone. Okay. Wasn't the... Windar people. Uh, no, the, the, it was the ten, ten Drakians who had the species points left. And I have no idea where the hell those people are. I'll be straight up. I, I literally don't know where they are. We we might have discovered them. I just I just don't know where the hell they are. Whether it was down here via a survey or something, I, I have no idea. I have a funny feeling this colony is going to get cut off fairly soon. That could be really funny. I see menus within when the menus. You are transparent, Emperor. <laughs> That's a June reference. I understood that reference. Okay, right. I had a couple of. I'm sure I had a couple of science ships. There you go. That science ship is just. Oh, that's missing in action. Okay. Uh, he has no orders. What are you doing then? Well, if you've got no orders, you must be sitting there doing nothing. Ah, you are in fact my spare science ship. That works out perfectly. Right. Uh. There's a, there's a bunch of things here. What are you doing? Entering hyperlane. Oh, it's automation. That's unclaimed. Right, no, hang on. Let's repurpose this guy. There's plenty of things to go. Ooh, derelict ship. Uh, ooh. So many things. Derelict ship. Uh, well, screw it. You're there. You may as well grab that and then do some archaeology while you're at it. Space archaeology! I don't even see the code anymore. Yeah, exactly, yeah. All I see is brunette, blonde, redhead. Yeah, that's true. Uh, yep, similar. I found out yesterday the reason my slave planets were constantly unemployed because slaves can't be specialists. Yeah, we, 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 uh, I got carried away with, um, uh, waging war on people and then I had mass unemployment on my, on my colonies. Uh, simply for the fact I'd forgotten to build anything there, which was, uh, kind of funny. But we're bimbling our way. We are we are bimbling. We're expanding as well. We're actually making some aggressive moves to take over this bit. You went full America. I mean, technically... Technically speaking... Well, that doesn't look good. The, the xenophobic goat people had a go at us first. So technically I was defending myself. The second time I was totally going to war with them, and in fact the third time, which will be in another couple of minutes when I've got all my stuff organised, that's totally going to be me attacking them. Uh, I wonder how good their fleets are actually. Crap. And crap. Okay, yeah, no, we, we, we haven't got anything to worry about here. Not a problem. It'll be fine. Okay, the, sh the crew of the ship has been found dead. 
Well, this looks like any uh, horror video game from the 2000s. Um, highly advanced brain parasites. Now, the really funny thing about that, they were actually discovered by science officer Fungus Among Us. So that's actually uh, remarkably apropos that the, f the guy called Fungus found a parasitic life form. That's kind of funny. Great. Uh, society research gained... Uh, what, for Fungus? Sh sure. Okay, that's that's okay. Right, now was that the ship I just sent out? I think it was, wasn't it? Oh, uh, actually, he must have done really quick work if that, that was actually him. Um... I think it was him, you know. Oh no, that's the one that disappeared. Oh no, that's him, he hasn't moved. Uh, where's the other one? Oh, it was him! Yeah, look at that! Look how fast he worked! That was amazingly quick work. Right, there's archaeological stuff. Uh, get, oh, hello, that was a save. Spaceborn life form encountered. Ooh, more spaceborn life forms. Let's hope they're friendly. Uh, oh, that's outside my empire, so I can't excavate things. That makes sense. I can't excavate it because it doesn't belong to me, which is fair. Though... Oh, okay, this is something they've taken. Okay, cool, this makes sense. Ironic, even. Yeah. Okay, right. How are we doing over here? Have we have we Avengers assembled yet? Are we still assembling? Oh! Oh, hello. Does somebody want to be friends? Diplomatic commercial pact invitation. Oh, it's my friends, the bugs. Hello, friendly bugs. What do you want to do? Uh... It's... <laughs> <laughs> These guys sound like door-to-door -door salesmen. This is great. Enter a commercial pact with us and maximize the meaningfulness of your existence. I've created a bunch of door-to-door -door insect people. This is... This is great. This will increase the value of both Empire's trade networks. The deal will grant us uh, 1.19 power and grant them 14.6 credits. And I mean, I don't see... Right, we're not losing anything, so they're also... Oh, wait a second. They're an enlightened monarchy, but they're ruthless capitalists. What have I done with these people? Uh, are you on vanilla or dive into the LDSC? Uh, Bamboo's Ballet and uh, Roach Mogul were very kind to buy me some DLC. I shall give you the list there. That is what we have currently. Um... However, a lot of that was introduced in the middle of this run, so we haven't seen the kind of, um... some of the beginning options with, with some of those, so it'll be interesting next time around, but uh, so, some of the events have kicked in. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with this, I don't see any reason not to. Uh, it would be really funny if we got taken over by the bug people, that would be great. Well, it wouldn't be great, it'd be terrible, actually. So hang on a second, if... Let me get an overview of here. So this is unclaimed here. Am I reading that right? It looks to be. Uh, it's quite close to all the crazy people. Well, I say it's quite close to all the crazy people. It's right on the edge of my empire. I should probably think about stealing some of this. Uh, sorry, I mean lawfully settling it. Not stealing it. Stealing stealing implies other things. Uh, especially as there's a spaceborn amoeba there, I could go and claim that system and then I'd have my own defense fleet there. That that could be funny. Oh no, I actually wanted to right click it, actually. Oh, that's because I've got two ships. And I only want one ship, thank you. Hang on. Hold your horses! Just one, thank you. Yes, why not expand? Uh, yes, there is a awful lot of DLC. Um, I am reliably informed that a must-have DLC is Utopia, apparently. Uh, so if you were, if you do have the opportunity to splash out on one DLC, apparently Utopia is the one to, the one to get. But yeah, I, 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 having a go with vanilla is not necessarily a bad idea at all. I, I literally, I started with vanilla plus Utopia, so, uh, yeah. Oh, another archaeological site, which I probably can't do anything about. Moscot 4. Tunnels, great. Tunnels are always fun. Playing since 17. Yeah, I think this came out in 2016, didn't it? 
Oh, okay. We've got a we've got a big chonk fleet here. Come on. It's just a matter of time now. <laughs> uh, come on. I wanted to get I want to get the uh, the one thing I did notice that that I didn't realize about these. Right. Spot spot the hilarious thing here. Collateral damage. 500%. So these are these Cybrex Warforms that I I found because of the the Cyber Ring doodah. Um and these guys do 500% collateral damage. So if I send these guys in to invade somewhere, there's not going to be an awful lot left standing, I feel, which is kind of funny. Yeah, the DLC subscription thing, I think people were actually uh I had some very mixed opinions about that when I was playing, uh, people were talking about it in chat last night while I was playing Helldivers, and I'm kind of like, yeah, I've got mixed feelings about that as well, because it's kind of like, I can see why they've done it, but I can kind of also see why people aren't super happy with it either. But, um, I, I don't know, it's, it's especially the fact that, that, that if you get all the DLC, it will cost you more than a, one of the subscriptions. But, yeah, I don't know. Um, hey, Bamboozle, how's it going? Oh. Uh, oh. Oh, no. Oh, oh, dear. We've, uh, we've oopsied. We've made the Zulu Kako militant, because of course we have. Uh, because that's what we do when we talk to people. Uh, great. I'm not sure that was a great idea. <laughs> oh, where was that? Remind me where that was, game. Seriously. Oh, they did the same thing with Crusader Kings. Oh, okay. So it's a bit of a... Uh, what's it? Um, a bit of a trend. Yes, I've just made the... I've just made the Atomic people more accepting of militants. That's... That's great. I'm sure... That won't be a problem. Uh, right, okay, what should we do? Uh, plant advanced knowledge so we can blow them up. Or infiltrate the government? I don't know. Oh, they're not sufficiently advanced. Uh, wait, these guys weren't xenophobes, were they? I have a horrible habit of doing that. The fanatic militarists and they're xenophobes. Yeah, I should probably just leave these guys alone. <laughs> I've just made them more militant. I've turned them into militant xenophobes. This is not... Never mind. Forget I did that. It's fine. Coming over here now, ignoring all that. Nothing bad happened. <laughs> um, did, okay. A favorable result. That, yeah, I don't think that was a good idea. Yeah, I keep, I keep forgetting that when I try to indoctrinate people, it makes them come around to my way of thinking. Unfortunately, my way of thinking is militant, and they're also xenophobes, so that's that's not good. That's not great. They may accidentally blow themselves up, which would be quite funny. I mean, terrible. It would be terrible, not funny. Right. Who's this? Is that is that my backup fleet, or is this... Oh, no, I think that's everybody. Oh, yeah, this is everybody. Okay, right. It's time to clear war on the goat people, because uh, they've annoyed me for too long. Where are they? I love how that's diplomacy. <laughs> Compromise, it would be terribly funny. <laughs> yeah. There is that. There is that. Right, let's declare war on these guys for the fifth time. Uh So I think this is all I've uh, all I've oh, the, the the only option I've got, isn't it, is end containment and that's it. Uh, end containment. End threat. When they get years and years deep on DLC, they add a subscription. Is it a terrible idea because the price of entry is so extreme? Yeah, I, 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 I don't think it's the worst idea. Um. Wait, what? Oh. Wait, huh? Oh, I just, I just un unclicked that. That was stupid. Because yeah, I think at full price isn't all the DLC something like two hundred quid or something. So, if, if you wanted a taste of some of it, I guess, you know, paying something a month isn't, like, crazy, but... Okay. We have declared war. 
We have declared war. So that's good. We can insult them at the same time. Uh, the narrow-minded ignorance of the Inventarian Exterminators has blinded you. Yeah, you know, that's gonna make them... That's gonna make things so much better. Okay. We are now at war! Right. Play it solidly and save yourself a fortune. Yeah, probably. <laughs> yeah, it's it's an option, isn't it? I mean, it's like... It's also, like, said like uh, Steam sales and Humble Bundle sales and stuff roll around fairly often. So if you're like, I must have this DLC, it's probably going to be discounted at some point anyway. But, but yeah, options are good. I'm always a big fan of options. Okay, I have a question for those of you who are slightly more uh, experienced at this game than I am. Um, well, they still have a pretty good garrison there. If I'm bombarding a planet and attacking it with my ground armies at the same time, will I accidentally bombard my own armies? Uh, because obviously I want to go like full ball. They'll be fine. I'm not. I'm not massively liking the sound of that because that's usually my battle cry of "it'll be fine," and that's usually the watchword for "it's not going to be fine." It's actually going to be quite the opposite. Well, we can always find out what's the worst could happen. Hey, the back frog, how's it going? Uh, everyone, go check out uh, the Mechanical Frog on YouTube. Um, he is a fine chap, does many, many little videos about Battletech. Go check him out. I think the bombardment stops when you land. Ah, now the trouble is, in that case, I've only actually got... Can we merge these? That would be really, that would be really helpful. There we go. So you see, my army strength is only 2k. Their defensive strength is like fucking... 1,802 because this mad bastard built like everything as a as a bunker so I'm I'm wondering maybe I should soften them up again a bit but I've got a bigger fleet this time maybe I should just send in the what have we got what's the biggest chunk of this I could break off the noodle strike force there we go no I just want to select them that are 10,000. Send them over there and start bombing stuff. You have double their combat strength. Uh, no I don't. No. No, no, no. Uh, where were we? See, their, their combat strength is 1,802. Mine's only 2,000. So I think maybe bombarding them a bit more might be a good idea, because they've just, they've reinforced everyone there. Though how that adds up to... Oh yeah, there's a ton of them. We'll, we'll soften them up with a bombardment, I think. Let's, let's start with a bombardment. Just a gentle one. See what happens. Uh, there's no route to read this system. There should be, because we're at war with them. Oh, there we go. Let the meat grinding commence. <laughs> Uh, come on, guys. Do you want to move now? Moving is good. Decided not to move. Oh, 60 days. Okay. I forget how long it takes to move. System survey. Oh, what's complete. that? Oh, yeah. War declaration. Oh, hello. Senate is now in session. Uh, up next. Comfort the fallen. Uh, I think I'm voting against this. No, wait. I'm, apparently I'm supporting this. Since when? No, I'm opposing this. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Uh, so actually, well, if I'm opposing this, why does it say I'm supporting it? Oh no, that's buzzword standardization. Okay, never mind. I knew that. Fleet stance is evasion. Uh, is it? It shouldn't be. Aggressive? No, fleet stance is aggressive. The uh, invasion <laughs> army is. Uh, oh no, the invasion one's set to passive for some reason. Station engaged. Council agenda ready. Oh god, it's all going off at the same time. Do we have a free commander? Uh, it's Quinn, son of List. He is actually in charge of the Noodle Strike Force. 
uh, which should rinse the station in about 30 seconds by my reckoning. Pretty much 30 seconds of real time. <laughs> Splat! Shouldn't have rebuilt it the first time. Right, let's go soften this, uh, let's go soften this place up. That was disgusting, and I'm here for it. Um, uh, hostile fleet's present. Uh, oh, 1,000? Oh, cheeky monkeys! Have they pulled on cheeky little flank? They have pulled cheeky little flank. Look at that. Ooh. Luckily, I've got an app for that. Yeah, I see you. It's going to take a little while to get there. That was not there a second ago. Spaceport under attack. Oh, God, it's all kicking off. Maybe this is a terrible idea. Right, hang on. Society. Society! Uh, naval capacity. Off for trading. Maybe we'll go for some of these tile block clearing things. That might be an idea. Council agenda ready. Launch agenda. The flesh is weak! Sure. Uh, let's stick that one on there. Right. Uh, yeah, that's cheeky. That's very cheeky, in fact. I never said I was a great fleet commander. Well, that is technically their territory. Oh, I just realized what I've done. So I, because I've declared war, they've closed their borders and I can't actually take these. To, so these are going to, they're going to take these back because I can't actually get to them because I am a very poor battle planner. So, never mind. That's perfectly okay. Probably. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. Goat people. We're bombing your planet. It'll be funny. Right. Is this going to be like... This is going to take a week again. Yeah, that's going to happen a lot. Effects on planet from devastation. Yeah, that is going to take... For this is going to take forever. I would have thought with all the like the clever like th like uh, technological advancements we made, uh, I would have thought that that we would have been able to kind of uh, colonization in progress. Uh, deal with that. Actually, wait. Let's hold. Let's hold here. Actually. Oh no! Here they come. That's what we wanted to do. I imagine that is probably the biggest fleet they've got, so if we took that out, that would not be a problem. Spaceport under attack. I mean, hopefully it's not a problem. We'll find out. Oh, I didn't think that one through, did I? Spaceport lost. Yep, yep, yep. I didn't reinforce those points very well. <laughs> okay, galactic domination, not my uh, strongest suit as it turns out uh, fleet order cancelled no that's fine fleet combat stats yeah that that was a bit of a stomping wasn't it sci-fi hamsters fighting space goats using power armor to increase their size and strength yeah that's basically what we've got going on haven't we uh, up next uh Pan-galactic recycling initiatives. Oh, why did I form this this thing? This is this is this is the, the pain in the ass. Um, diplomatic weight from economy minus twenty percent. Consumer goods upkeep minus five. Clear blocker time plus ten percent. No, that sounds like a shit idea. Right, where's that fleet? There it is. Right, come on, go get these guys, because we should be able to take them out in fairly, fairly. Oh, but yeah, they ran away. Yeah, this sounds seems like a fairly familiar situation, doesn't it? They're kind of like, haha, and then they're like, oh shit, we're running away. Staying and fighting is clearly not what they do. Research complete. Which is just annoying as hell. Uh, okay, new research. Oh god, we have many new researchers. Uh, wormhole travel! 
Ooh, uh, gravitic senses. Uh, I mean, wormhole travel sounds fun. What unlocks components? Shields. Didn't we already have shields? Or are these like magic shields? I don't know. I'm confused. You have wormholes. Screw it. Um, max occupation garrisons. Edicts funds. Cyto revitalization, Vi revitalization center. I don't even know what that is. What'd that do? Medical workers turn consumer goods into amenities. Pop growth speed. Oh, advanced medical treatments. Okay. Ceramo metal infrastructure. That sounds fun. Infrastructure path. Okay. Yeah, why not? Why not? We'll do it live. Mm. Uh, <clears throat> oh, am I just gonna like destroy every? Oh no, I told them to skip that, didn't I? Because I was gonna break. Construction complete. I was gonna try and break their fleets Hostile in one go. Fleet detected. That's fine. Oh, they got. Oh, okay. These guys have actually built up a decent amount of stuff. Uh, in in their. How the hell did they do that? Because it said their stuff was pathetic compared to mine. 4,000 in a fleet is not pathetic. That's actually pretty substantial. Um... Hmm. Okay, what I think we're probably going to have to do is uh, rethink that one. You need to stop there for a second. Lozenge yourself, my good man. Yeah, I actually forgot to do that before I started. Let's let's get them some backup and let's send the uh, invasion fleet here and see what happens. What's the worst that could happen? Land armies. I think they're going to get crushed, but you know. Uh, thank you for the hydrate, Roach Mogul. I wonder if that still says. Let's have a look. Uh, hostile. Da, da, da. No, no, it's not here. It's uh. Yeah, I thought that I thought their fleet thing compared to us. Yeah, it says fleet power is pathetic. A fleet of four thousand doesn't strike me as, as pathetic, but you know. What do I know? So we really should just wipe these from the planet, the face of the planet, really, shouldn't we? Face of the planet, face of the earth. Right, what's going on here? Uh, terraforming candidate discovered. Uh, probably miles away, not worrying about that. Hostile fleets, uh, yes, I think those are the ones that... Oh! Oh, really? You you guys have decided to, to send your solitary understrength fleet at me. Okay. Works for me, because that's not going to go well for you. I would think. Oh, did they leave already? Planetary invasion begun. Oh, no, here we go. Right, we have started planetary invasion. Uh, you guys aren't aggressive? You are... No. Uh, passive. Why have I got these on passive? There we go. This could explain a bit. That's more like it. This should be over in an eye blink. Hostile fleet engaged. And eye blink. Yeah. Pretty much. Right. Invasion. So. Uh, Turk. Daughter of something. Wait, I can rename the I can rename the leaders for them. Wait, did they capitulate already? Wait, did they just give up? What's going on? Why can I rename an enemy leader? That's quite weird. Okay, I can I can rename an enemy leader. That's weird. I didn't think I could do that. I thought they capitulated for a second there immediately, but no. Apparently, I can just randomly rename people. That don't even belong to my civilization. Hostile station engaged. Uh, also, where the hell? Where the hell are my actual armies? Ah, oh, here we go. Uh, disengage reserves invader. Oh, that's gone up to two thousand and something now. Um. I'm 
this this could be interesting. Oh yes, the devastation. Okay, okay. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, the funny thing about this is that apparently I can cause more planetary devastation with the Slowbricks war forms than I can with my own spaceships. That's quite funny. I think that's like your Vichy, Vichy Stooge. I don't think so. Because I don't own the planet yet. So are we are we winning? I'm not sure. Well, it says we're twice twice their strength, so maybe we are winning. Oh yeah, we're winning. Oh yeah, that's that's gonna be a fairly solid win. Yeah, okay, that's yep, yeah, no, that's gonna be over pretty quick. Good to know. Okay. <laughs> Uh, where is my other fleet? Um, there. Is that the one that just beat beat them up? That's good. Right, where's their big fleet gone? There. That looks a bit problematic. Yeah, just, just a little bit. Uh, oh, there's many other things going on. Invasion, uh, relic activation. Uh, right, how much is this costing me now? 12,000 minerals, 3,000... Yeah, no, we can do that. That's not a problem, because I think we're still building these damn things. Yes, we are. In fact, uh... Yeah, we've, we've, we've got, like, another stack of those coming in. Uh, timed project. Debris, small auto cannon, subspace sensors. I don't think I'm that bothered about that. Unless I have a science vessel in fairly. Oh, that's literally here. No, I'm not worried about that. The war forms are winning it for you. Without them, you probably lose that. Yeah, I. I that's why I waited for them. Uh, because I thought I thought it was going to be quite. Uh, it was going to be quite gnarly, and I was not wrong. And, and they have all gone splat. Enemy planet secured. Handled. Uh, we have successfully invaded Etris Colony. And we've actually blown it to shit by 41%. So now it's my problem. <laughs> Great. That's great. Um, well, the great thing about it is uh, now it's probably fairly well uh, defended due to the huge amount of um, fortresses I now own. So that's good. Uh, I best get an extra. Have I got a backup fleet somewhere? Oh, how come I haven't claimed this yet then? Oh, it probably hasn't ticked over yet. Or have I? Oh, no, I haven't claimed Council it yet. Agenda available. Uh Oh, hello. Spaceport new... under attack. Oh, pause. Hold my ph hold the phone. Hold the bus. All of these things. A new faction has been gaining traction in the eternal political landscape of the Hamsterian Conclave, the Neutrality Society. Oh, really? Really? Where are these motherfuckers? The Neutrality Society, an isolationist faction. Xenophobe and pacifists, pacifist ethos. Okay. And they have 39 pops behind them. Oh. These are the people we just, uh, we just stole their, their colony from. That's why. First planetary, <laughs> baby's first planetary, uh, first planetary invasion. Yeah. So, uh, oh, now we own it. Right, so we've made a horrible mess of this. Gas extraction wells, ruined. Uh, good. Um. Oh, wait, hang on a minute. Does that mean I have... Does that mean I have goat people? I think I have goat people. I have goat people in my, uh, in my defensive army. That's quite funny. They're probably not very happy. Right, oh uh, god, what do I do now? <laughs> uh, did I build a starport here? That's a question. I did. 
No, it's an anchorage. Oh, that wait, that is a starport, isn't it? Oh, no, it isn't. Why do they not build a starport here? Huh? That's so weird. The AI's real plan, poison chalice of a planet to pacify you from within, probably, yeah. Goat warriors. There's another colony to take. Is there? I don't think so. Oh! New Celestaris! You are correct. Uh, they have no armies there. Uh, so that's gonna be an easy one. Right, how do I fix this place? This place is a mess. Um... Probably need to recruit some more armies. Wait, I can only recruit goat people from here. Okay. That seems dangerous. It'll fix itself over time. Okay. So does this actually have an FTL inhibitor on it already? It does, because of this, the planet. Okay, so... I guess we head over here and do the same with this one. Did we lose any of the war forms? I think we might have lost a couple of them, you know. Or maybe we didn't. No, we didn't. I thought we did, but apparently we didn't. Right, let's have a look at the defenses over here. I am now a terrible... Yeah, they did. They completely just, um... Covered it in fortresses. There's, there's, there's nothing here. We can just take it. Oh, it's a tomb world. That's probably why they weren't too bothered about it. <laughs> that makes sense. But well, I'm gonna take it anyway. And then it's mine. Mine or mine. It's no Cadia, yeah. They only just colonized that like, tomb world, but why did they even colonize, colonize it? I don't know. Uh, I don't even know what their uh, habitability preferences are. But this looks like optimism. This looks like a lot of optimism. Uh, yeah, I, 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 I don't really know. Uh, cutthroat politics, fanatic purifiers, spiritualists, xenophobes. Yeah, I don't think they would like being on a tomb world. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, they turned up to a tomb world and just said, We will build a paradise! Behold! <laughs> and everyone's like, This place is a fucking tomb. What are you on about? You know. Right, how goes the war? Uh, pretty Space good. Lost. Uh, that's okay, that's fine. Because I don't know how to make that work because of their Planetary big combo fleet. Begun. And planetary invasion over and done with because nobody was there. Good to know. Uh, don't actually quite know uh, what to do about this place now. Probably build some. Actually, do we do we want this? Habitability breakdown three percent. Uh, it's a rural tomb world, that makes no sense. Okay, so this place is basically more hassle than it possibly could be. So, can we... Yeah, uh, how, how do we decolonize somewhere? Is that a thing we can do? It's like, obviously, uh, wait, hang on, what's this? Luxuries distributed, amenities, immigration pool will uh, expire in... They, they were trying to make this place nice for people. They were like, come here, there's gold. And it's like, no. Uh, decisions. No, create robot assembly. Oh, hang on. Wait, you can go to the other planet in the system and move the props from New Celestaris to there. Well, I'm not going to want to send them to the tomb world, am I? That's a terrible idea. Or do you mean take the people from here and settle them on the other one? I don't know if I've got... I've actually got robot stuff. I don't think I've actually got robots yet. Oh, move these guys. So move these guys. Oh, that is New Celesteris. Sorry. So what have they got here? 
Uh, there's a there's a Urien population. That's a bit random. Oh, they don't want the planet either. Right, okay. So resettle. Uh, okay, so where do we want? Uh, do, 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 do. New Celestaris. No, not New Celestaris. Uh, Etris Colony. Ah, I see! Resettling this pop will cause Hamsterian Conclave to abandon their colony on New Celestaris. The resettlement cost has been increased by 200%. Well, that's uh, 200. Well, that's fine. Uh, did that work? Yay! Handled. Yeah, why the why the hell they wanted to colonize there? I do not know. That's a interesting concept. Stellaris has incredible music. Yeah, the the music is great. The music is absolutely brilliant. Right, so, uh, where can we invade next? That's the question. So where's, where's their big fleet? Their big fleet is buggered off. Hmm. Well, actually, I guess the smart thing to be would be, are these guys still moving? Right, let's get my invasion fleet and everyone here, and then we're going to go off to this place and take that next. I probably need some more invasion forces. That might be an idea. Uh, can I do that here, or do I need a colony? I think I need a colony, don't I? Uh, Genetically engineer a goat template and turn them into battle thralls. I can hear the music in this time too. <laughs> yeah, yes, that's because as as stated uh, last stream, I I've been doing a slight oopsie with my um uh audio stuff, but uh yeah, we we we're, we're good now, mostly. We're mostly good, mostly. Uh, okay, so if I congregate here, I'm gonna yeah, I need some more. I need some more troops. Um, uh, God, where is my nearest colony? Uh, Umboglit. I forgot about that. Hello, one Boglit. Um, now, how do you do the thing where you send armies to places so you don't have to keep telling them to move? Uh, I don't remember how to do that. So you can't build armies here because we don't have a... No, I guess we can't. Uh, I think I've got Sins of a Solar Empire, I believe. I think I picked up on Humble at one point. Don't quote me on it, but something makes me think I've actually got it. Uh, what can we do here? Um, recruit. New assault armies from population of this planet. Okay. Oh wait, these these are gonna be these gonna be the Urians though, aren't they? Oh no, we can do Hamsterians. Okay. Are they actually any better than us? Uh, no, we're better than they are. Okay. You don't want to change all the available goats into bloodthirsty warriors. You can resettle one goat pop somewhere. Then apply your template to the one pop. Right, so where's the place? Wait, hang on a minute. So we, we've literally just stolen a planet from somebody, and now we're talking about doing genetic modification to turn them into more suitable, like, <laughs> servants. Is that what we're saying? Is that what I'm hearing? <laughs> uh, hey, I can snuffle. Xenophobes just xenophiles you haven't converted yet. Quite possibly. Right, uh, how do we do that? It's species, isn't it? Right. Uh, oh, there we go. We've got some, we've actually got some goat people. We've actually given the goat people full citizenship. Is this a good idea? <laughs> I'm not sure this is wise. Oh, the Tentrachian have turned up. We finally found them. Where the hell are they? 
Hammond Star. Okay, where the? Oh, that was the Brent. That was the new colony over here. I'm getting distracted again. I'm getting far too di uh, far too distracted. Right, hang on. I need to I need to have a look at these guys because now yeah now they're showing up. Right, so they are forcefully devolved. And they have a continental preference, so they like places that we like. That's quite funny. Yeah, remember to focus. Yeah, we'll come back to that. Let's 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 do what we were talking about, which was uh, goat people, right? So you can create a template. Okay, so they have. So actually, what do they even have? These guys, arid preference, docile. Docile, really? I suppose they're goats. Natural sociologists. Communal. Sedentary. And deviants. Excellent! That, they sound like a fun time. Uh, what's a yellow planet anyway? Uh, that is like middling colonization. So green is good. That's like above 80. Uh, percent yellow is probably in the middle somewhere, and red is like don't in, don't inhabit this. This is a terrible idea. Uh, so they like arid preference. The Yuri like Gaia worlds. Okay, right. Let's have a look. Dear God, what can we do here? Trait points left one. So, can we actually like get rid of some of these? Oh, they've only got one trait point, so I can't actually... I can't change any of these. Oh, I can get rid of Deviant. That works. Uh, oh, that gives me a trait pick of one. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Uh, Savannah, Tropical, Continental, Ocean... Desert. Hmm. Okay, yeah, got rid of Deviant. Uh, I don't think anything else costs one. Everything else costs at least two. Oh, no, Resilient uh, costs one. Enduring, Venerable, Talented, Traditional, Nomadic, Charismatic, Well, actually, hang on. Oh yeah, not enough trait. It says trait picks left one, but I can't add. I can't add anything. Even stuff that costs one. It says trait picks one. Oh, is that literally all I can do right now? Okay. Uh, we should probably call these something different, shouldn't we? Add another trait if I had another point. Oh, trait points left zero. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I used the point of removing Deviant. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Uh, should we rename some of these? Because these are ours now. No. No, that is not what we're calling them, Roach Mogul. Th thank you for your input, but no. I see. Got it. Uh, we will call them the Goatarians. Let me see if I can get my plurals right. Plural. Adjective. Wait, would adjective be Gotarian again? <laughs> I, I was crap at English class. I like the creative part of English class, but it was like plurals, adjectives, what are these? I have no education. Gotar actually works for plural. That will work. Like the Gotar Empire. And then what? What would be the what would be a good adjective? Gotarian again? I don't know. We can change this later, probably. Maybe Gotar is the adjective. Adjective would be Gotarai. <laughs> Oh my god. Goated. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> 
<laughs> the goated Goatarians. <laughs> yeah. Hey, bird pies, how's it going? Let's let's go with this for now until I actually realize I've made a terrible mistake. Right. Uh. Uh. Now I cocked this up last time. Is it cre create template? Or is that what we just did? I messed this up last time. Oh, no, there we go. Oh, apply to wall. Bollocks. Uh, that didn't work, then, did it? Oh, apply template. Uh... Wait, hang on. Wait a second. We, we've got Evandarians on Gaia. When did that happen? Huh? Hold on a second. When did that happen? I mean, yeah, but we literally only just... We only just actually, uh... Oh, what's happened there? Low stability. Okay, that's fine. Okay, fine. They they were already there. That's fine. Oh, they emigrated. Well, yeah, that makes sense, doesn't it? Yeah, that's a that's a fair point. <laughs> I blew up their planet, so they're like, "Fuck this shit, I'm out." Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. Hey, math, welcome back. Good point. Good point. Right. So if we apply it to all. Uh, right. Yeah. Species modification. Yep, sure. Go for it. Cool. Hey, Omega Forge. How's it going? I can see the Tendrakian thingies. Yes, they've they've just they just appeared. So they were pretty sapient. Oh, I had no idea where they were. I had no idea where they were. Applied to all versions of their species. Later on, we might get more points to change their genetics. Ah, oh, okay. Right. Good. So we uh, stole their planet from them. And then we forcefully changed their genetic template. Um, because reasons. Right. Okay. So, uh, yeah, let's, have, let's go find the Tendrakians because... Yeah, it was pre-sapient, but they weren't they weren't showing up on the uh species list. They just weren't there at all. So I don't quite know what's going on there. Set rights. That's so they're mine, are they? Yeah, they're they're an Empire species. Okay, let's go have a look and see what they're up to. Did you click the button to start the modification? Uh probably not, knowing me. Uh, I did. Yeah, I thought I did. I did start it. Oh, there you go. Cool. Uh, right. Now then. Yeah, Tendrakian. Yeah, okay. Huh, cool. They're not ready. You're ready to be battle thralls, but we'll get there. Yes, I'm sure we will. Right. So these guys. Uh, can we actually? Can we actually, like, contact these people now? I don't think we can. Because they don't show up... Because they're pre-sapient, I suppose they don't show up here at all, do they? No. Okay. Because I think I had the option of uplifting these guys. But, uh... We oh, I see. Right. So we can only uplift one species at a time. Got it. Yeah, so clearly these guys were, like, uh, much, much more evolved than they currently are, and something terrible happened to them, so that's quite funny. Uh, science ship. Uh, yeah, I wasn't too bothered about that. That's fine. Uh, void clouds? Uh, wait, no, hang on. Were we... That's society research. That's... Yeah, why not?
They were the ones who were forcibly devolved. Yes. Uh, I don't quite know what happened to them, but uh, it wasn't me. Uh, low stability. Right. Unsurprisingly, the colony I just... Uh, wait, what the hell? Uh, apparently we're, I'm making robots. It was me. It was a mega vault with the devolving beam. That's, it sounds like an intergalactic game of Pluto, wasn't it? It was Omega Forged in the colony with a devolving beam, yeah. Apparently we are assembling robot people. I didn't realise we had robot people. Oh, they have they have a robot assembly plant? That would make sense, wouldn't it? Ah, now you see, that would be great if they had that on the tomb world, because then we could colonise the tomb world with robots, but we didn't do that. Right, so... This planet is the broadside of fucked right now. Because these silly wankers decided having four fortresses was a good idea. How do I fix this? Station an army there because they're going to rebel. Uh, probably. Wait, are these guys loyal to me or are they... Or do we own them? It's our planet, so I guess these guys belong to us? I don't know what's going on. With a crime-fighting precinct. That might not be a bad idea. Uh, replace. Aha! Uh, right, where are we? Do, 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 do. It is a... Precinct houses. Nice. Um... Probably need to replace this with, I don't know, some luxury residences or some literally anything that isn't a fortress. Hollow theatre. Uh, do they already have one of those? Apparently not. We broke the gas extraction wells, but that's okay. Hollow theatres. Okay. That's one of those. Uh, what else can we do? What are we lacking in here? Well, they are lacking in everything. Jesus Christ. Um, luxury residences? Maybe? Replace the ruin first. Oh, yeah, we can fix that. Oh, actually, we have to demolish it. Okay. Errant, errant Terminator fire uh, leveled this, this gas extraction well, unfortunately. Uh, so yeah, I guess we have to demolish that, don't we? Okay. Oh, oh, I broke it. I really broke it. Never mind, that's fine. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave at least one there, I think. Um, because that seems like a good idea. But I don't think we need. To, do we need two? Increase naval capacity, stability, and spawn defense armies. Oh, well, my naval cap shot up. Oh, yeah, my naval cap shot up as well. That's quite funny. Yeah, they did. They stomped all over it. Uh, probably not being idea to do some mining districts as well. We can bit some of those as well. Okay, there we go. Have enough food? No, I don't have enough food. Oh, can't add any more of those. Never mind. Right, let's let's see how that works. Oh, there's no blockers. Okay, then. Oh, ruined district. Oh! Oh, I did... Aha! Cool, didn't spot that. Yep, didn't spot that. Losing the planet is probably a rebellion. Uh, yeah, I think... Uh, well, we still have my... Um, well, hang on a minute. This is the thing, though. So if there is a rebellion, there's they have, like, a load of these armies, but they're all goat people. So is that... Is that okay? Or should I replace them with some of my guys? I don't know. Hey, Wolf Warrior!
I don't know. I don't know. All right, what's this? Council agenda available. Don't think I ever had a rebellion. Just have a good dose of managed democracy. <laughs> Could just evade with the war forms again if they rebel. Okay. Uh, no, this is this is. I already did this. I think. Right. What's this? Invasion over. Yep, we knew that. That's good. Okay. So far, so good. So what? Uh, that's unemployed. That's fine. Oh, it just went off cooldown. Got it. I know where that giant invasion fleet went to. I, I, I need to know. Probably build some more ships, to be honest. Oh, wait, these are upgrading? Design can be upgraded. Huh. Why not? System survey complete. Oh, hello. Obey, or else the walking metal gods will return. <laughs> uh, oh, our observation puff boast above Unar 3 is an illegal settlement. Hamsterian smugglers. Uh, oh, wait, where's this? Is this the place we're looking at? Is this the place we're spying on? It is the place we're spying on. Clear them out. Issue special product raid smuggler base. Awareness increased by 30. Uh, oh dear. Uh, so we're going to need a transport ship for that. Okay. Uh, oh god, this is the if this is the horrible bumblefuck spot in the middle of nowhere. Where the Jackley just head off and took off everything. Right, okay. Uh we need a spare invasion fleet. That's what we need. <clears throat> oh, look at that. I've got a spare uh I've got I've got some spare Cybrex. That that works. <laughs> That would be fucking terrifying, wouldn't it? It'd be kind of like... Hey, we've got like, uh, uh... Yeah, there's been so many events in Unar, it's it's bonkers. I should probably reinforce this, because, well, we're in the middle of Jackley territory, that's fine. Can you imagine? It's like, haha, we've set up a nice little criminal enterprise. Ah, uh, and then I send in some Terminators. You know, that'd be great. Ah, oh, who, stole, who stole that? Who stole the maelstrom? Oh no, nobody did. Interesting. That's actually free. Maybe I should steal that because... Oh no, I can't. It's miles away from anywhere. Never mind. Oh, oh. Oh, that's 114. Upgraded. Good stuff. Uh, awareness increased. That's... Fine. There's not much they can do about that anyway. <laughs> Am tube shorts. Sounds slightly rude, doesn't it? Right. Uh, so, I mean, we could quite easily go over here and... Sp okay. I have a funny feeling that all these little factions that are popping up everywhere are entirely entirely around the planet we just stole because it's the goat people going we do not like this you know because the amount of factions in my um fucking thing has just tr doubled overnight So let's go have a look because where were they? No, where is it? Uh, politics. Here we go. Council of Scientific Betterment. Twelve populations on Etris Colony. Yes, it's goat people. Wait, I can manage factions. Suppress faction, promote faction, embrace... Oh, that's hilarious. I didn't realize I could do that. I can crush them! I can crush them. 
Uh, I love how the Neutrality Society has zero, um, <laughs> zero acceptance. That's quite funny. Well, which one's the xenophobic faction? I don't think it's this one. They're materialist. I mean, materialist is okay. Uh, neutrality society. Oh, they're xenophobes. Wait, guiding ethic xenophobe. Wait, but what's the second symbol? Okay, yeah, we should. Well, we should totally suppress these people. Wait. They're pacifist xenophobes? How can you have pacifist xenophobes? It's like, we hate everybody, but we can't be asked to do anything about it. <laughs> is, is that how that works? <laughs> That's correct. Well, they want to be just left alone. Oh, I see. They don't want to fight, but they hate me anyway. Right, so what happens if I try to pacify them? What happens if I try and suppress them? Faction suppressed modifier added. Faction approval minus 50%. Xenophobia suppressed modifier. Xenophobia ethics attraction minus 75. Well that sounds like a good idea, because I don't I don't I don't want to promote this type of thinking. How to pacify a pacifist. Yeah, let's do that. I'll do. I didn't realize we could do this. Right, so what do we got? We have the Patriotic Vanguard, which are militarists. Why is it not telling me what their other, their other, their second thing is? It says militarist and something, but I can't, it won't tell me that for some reason. Uh, local rivalry, benevolent. God, I have no idea. Oh, apparently the, the, they're quite popular. Uh, because I guess they coincide with most of what we do. Uh, Xeno Protection Committee, they, they're, they're happy. Autotarian. Authotarian. Uh, Authotarian. Authotarian militarists, okay, sure. Okay. Authoritarian. I, they're up the top here. I don't know why I didn't notice that before. Yeah, so pacifist, uh, authoritarian, uh, yeah, tourist. Okay, cool. Right! Okay, let's wait until our, uh, ridiculous, uh, invasion fleet rocks up, and then we're gonna go kick these guys in the face. Uh, splitting the- oh no. Physicists from the alien civilization on Boltris 4 have managed to split the atom. Oh no, it's the- it's the Uindarians have now- got the capacity to nuke themselves. That's great. Authoritarian. They only need people who's writing books. <laughs> yeah. Books? Why did I pronounce that like that? Books! Yes, they, they eat authors. That's literally what they do. Come on, invasion fleet. And then we're all gonna go and have a party down here. Hostile fleet engaged. Oh, hello. Where's that? Where be that? Hostile? Oh, that's the science vessel. Well, that's going to run away, isn't it? Oh, no, no, didn't have a chance. He, <laughs> he tried to run away, but he exploded uh, due to the massively overwhelming firepower we had. Um, I, I don't actually. Yeah, look, look, like space torpedoes, plasma shit. Yeah, that didn't that didn't last very long. Sounds like a society by bad writing is punishable by imprisonment. Yeah. Curse those books. Yeah, I don't know. Small shields, subspace sensors. That's not that interesting. Let's let's get down to the main business here. Come on, Terminators. Hurry up. Uh oh, hello. Rising unemployment on Etris Colony. Yeah, it's the goat people. Again local crime organization increase unemployment benefits or do nothing I guess we increase the benefits because otherwise that increases crime uh, we do have the precinct being built there so that, that'll be a stopgap that's fine goddamn goat people have we actually managed to uplift any of these buggers yet has that actually happened yet 
Are we sure I got that right? Yeah, it says apply template. Oh, oh, that's a research product, isn't it? It was here, wasn't it? Uh, there we are. Species modification. There we go. Michael Bay would be fucked. Yeah, pretty much. Michael Bay, great with explosions, not so great with virtually anything else. Special project complete. Uh, oh, we raided the smugglers with our giant robots. That's good. Hey, Tank Hair, how's it going? Uh, we enslave everyone without a job. We can't have unemployment if there's no one to be employed. That's that's an interesting approach, Tank Hair. I'll take that under advisement. Uh, thanks for the suggestion. Okay, a brief firefight. Yeah, sure. Uh, okay, significant victory. Don't mind if I do. Come on, I want to invade somewhere. God damn it. I'm getting impatient. More invading needed. Actually, what I should probably do is probably bring these guys up a little bit just in case. Oh, what's happened now? Ah, traditions. Okay, so we have... Ah, now... Uh... I regretted not taking this one last time because actually it turns out that would probably be pretty good because we've got some we got a lot of fortresses in places now. How in the seven hells haven't you taken dearth yet? Uh probably due to mismanagement on my part. So our options are fortress doctrine or resistance is frugal. Let's go with that. Uh, where's Dearth? What is Dearth? Who is Dearth? How is Dearth? Dearth is the system that goes to de Depray. Construction complete. Uh, oh yeah, I should have invaded that in order to open up the, the uh... Oh yeah, that would... You know? That's a very good point. I'm going to send the lesser of my three fleets. Oh, God. The lesser of my three fleets to go and uh, nobble that. Void unclouded. Oh, this, this could be good. <clears throat> it's actually impressive you haven't taken it. I didn't notice. I didn't notice. I forgot. Okay. The void clouds are amongst the oldest in the universe. Ugh. Okay. They might be smart. Okay, so this will not stand in our way. Cloud Destroyer modifier added. Damage to Void Clouds plus 33. Or Humbling. Void Loops modifier added. Physics research from thing. Interesting. I'm gonna go with Humbling. Let's do humbling. Yeah, what I did, I, I, you can. So here's the thing. I, I think I had my fleets on passive. So unless I actually told them to do something or attack somewhere, they wouldn't do it. That's probably what happened. Like that, for example. Let me, let me double check that. Oh no, it's set to aggressive. That's fine. Oh, we can have a robotic assault army. Oh, hello. The the uh, robot uprising has begun. They're just old, yeah. So we can actually build robot. We can build other types of robots now. Oh wow. Okay. What? Oh, wow. Okay. Lots of things. Integrated cybernetics. We're gonna become cyber hamsters. This is what's gonna happen. The FTL points might be close enough for them not to attack the outpost. Oh, maybe I guess. Should, should we become cyborgs? Should we become cyborg hamsters? That could be funny. Habitability plus 5%. Sure, why not? Why not? Right, are we actually uh, are we actually taking this place now? Is that what's happening? There we go. We got there at the end. Blink and you'll miss Hostile it. Station engaged. 
blink and you'll miss it. Hey, Craig PD, how's it going? Got it. <laughs> Colony established. That's mine. Uh, unspent trait points. It's still talking about these. Oh, I can uplift them now. Wait, does that mean we uplifted the goats? Yes! We have Goatarians! <laughs> we have forcefully modified them. Ah. No water cannons, what madness. We're doing okay without them, Craig, honestly. Heavy metal hamsters, yeah. We 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 jumped auto cannons. We went straight to like plasma and torpedoes. Okay, cool. Well that's uh that's modified them. Right, uh are we repairing this right now? We are repairing this. Okay, this is good. Uh Annoyingly I'm out of Starbase things, cat, which is kind of annoying. I should probably build a defense platform or something. That might not be a terrible idea, might it? Uh Amoeba Happy Fun Time class. I I definitely wrote that. That was definitely me. Because this is like right in the middle of enemy territory. Let's do that. Uh, didn't you take the ascension perk where you can make the hamsterian cyborgs? Ah, uh, I might have done if I could remember where that screen was. I could tell you. Oh, I found it. The flesh is weak. Uh, yes, cybernetic technologies as research options. Yes, that's what I did. You are indeed correct. Uh, we should probably reinforce here as well. That would be a smart idea, wouldn't it? Right, are we are we set? I think we're set. Yes. Right. Send in the clowns. Uh, right. Actually, no. Let's let's get everyone involved here. Actually. Uh, yeah, we built one that spits squid at people, because I, I felt the idea was amusing. Uh, I don't know what that was telling me, but never mind, this is fine. So, we could actually uplift the Tendrakion if we really wanted. That could be funny. I don't know whether it would do us any good. <laughs> what can we do? Uplift this pre sentient species to full-fledged pops in our empire. Wait, we haven't even- they don't even know we exist yet, do they? Do they? I don't think they know we exist. Maybe they do. Oh, we're sharing a planet with them. They probably should know we exist. I'm not sure. Oh, they're pre-sapient. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, there they are. They're happy, though! They are- they are 100% happy. So that's good. They're like monkeys, basically. Yeah, they they started out as something pleasant, but somebody somebody did bad things to them. Oh, I just noticed. Is that okay? There's another fleet there. How well protected is this? Oh, it's covered in it's covered in space amoebas. That's good. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. Right. Are we are we all assembled? Uh, I think we are. Okay, let's go and uh, have a word with this. Right, so this is their... So here's the thing. If we take this away from them, does that mean we just win because that's their home world? Or does it mean we have to keep going? Also, I still don't know where their giant fleet went. Ignorance is bliss, yeah. Oh, oh dear. Uh, uh, oh dear. Nuclear, who, who is it? Oh, it's the Yundarians. They're about to blow themselves up. The hedgehog is not happy once again. Um, okay. Covertly in infiltrate and de-escalate or let them blow themselves up. There's no further need for espionage? Oh, that's revealing ourselves. Okay, uh... We could just step in and say, howdy, it's us. 
shouldn't you apply the template for the Urian? Didn't I didn't I do that already? I'll have a look in a second. Oh. That's not what I meant to do. I clicked the wrong thing. Oh. I clicked the wrong thing. Uh that didn't do what I thought it would do. <laughs> that was a misclick! Oh no! Well that's that never mind. Oops. Um well we don't have to worry about them anymore because they just blew themselves up. Ah, <laughs> uh, oops. I thought when it says there's no need for espionage, I thought that means we'd reveal ourselves to them, but that just means we'd stop giving a shit. Oh well, never mind. Yeah, congratulations. It's uh potentially habitable. <laughs> can we can we terraform it? No. Never mind. Whoops! Ah, it's just a tiny, tiny little oopsie. Tiny, tiny little mistake. Oops, all nuclear apocalypse. What's the galactic opinion on you now? Uh, I don't think it's changed an awful lot, to be honest. I think they're okay. It was an honest mistake. Right, come on. Let's have a go at these guys. Come on. Hurry. Faster. Oh, 90 days. Good god. Oh no, you've arrived piecemeal. That's not what I wanted to do. Survey complete. Uh, though I think... Oh, there we go. There we go. Right, this should be an absolute one-sided... Utter one-sided stomp, this one. Yeah, in fact, their own fleet... Oh wait, hang on a minute. That's their... Uh... Yeah, their own fleet just ran away. That's quite funny. Their own fleet just ran. That's that's kind of amusing. Never give barely awakened. So well, I didn't give give it to them. They kind of uh, came up with it by themselves, and that didn't go so well. And I I clicked the wrong button. That's the uh, the other thing. Oh, there's their big fleet. Okay. Oh, find us keepers. A particularly observant operative in the Evandarian exterminators laid their paws on part of an Evandarian encryption key. It would seem a careless Evandary politician mislaid the advice while commuting. This bodes well enough for operations in the... A study that was... Code-breaking. Okay, cool. Works for me. Oh, uh, the election has, has commenced. Uh, once again, I put... Can I actually, uh... Can I actually vote on this one? I could actually vote on this one, but it cost me 4,000 unity. I, I, I'll, I'll leave them to it. I want to see what happens. If you take their home world, their entire economy should go squiffy. Oh, okay. Um, Actually, to see... Oh. Well. We really should vote Dr. Oppenhamster back in, because not only is he immortal, he has uh, leadership experience... Uh, Empire research speed increase and uh, military theory speed increase because he is the be all and end all. So I can actually pull that off. There we go. Handled. Uh, open council position. Uh, oh, I do. Right, I need a scientist here. Um, oh, some of these are terrible. Oh, that's leader trait. Okay. Uh, that's Empire Effects. Uh, that's a leader trait. That doesn't count. Statecraft. Research speed minerals. Uh, yeah, why not? There we go. And he's immortal. Yes, indeed, he is immortal. Due to, uh, hilarious, uh, happenstances in space. Yep. Right, I should probably get this, uh, get another fleet here as well, just to guard the rear, as it were. Uh, have we actually built a station here? Oh god, we have. We've already built a very big station here. Jesus Christ. Or we stole it. One of the two. 
Oh, yeah, I built a defense platform there, didn't I? Because I'm actually learning. If a science ship doesn't get shot down, it can live to 2,500. Yeah. He's doing all right for himself. Oh, here comes the big boys. Are they gonna are they gonna have a go? It won't work. I'll tell them that for free. Relic activation. Right, can we afford this? 1400, 3000 unity. Oh god, that's gonna use all my unity. But we'll get candy. I should really build some more ships. Look at the amount of ships I can fucking build right now. Uh, sure. Let's get building. Jesus Christ. You officially passed the mid-game. <laughs> Excellent. Right. Um, where's my nearest... Uh, uh, like, shipyard. Is it one of these? Yes! Now it is time. How does it feel? Oh, 2300s are beginning to the mid-game. Oh, I see! This is, uh... Isn't, isn't this a countdown to when the bird people win by default or something? Because I, I forgot to set the victory conditions. Or turn them off or something daft. I can't remember. Uh, interesting! I, I feel like I, I vaguely know what I'm doing. A hundred more years till the end game. Oh, lovely. Right. Uh, so, let's do... Uh, let's do some Ovets. Let's do some schlepping classes. Oh, we've got two of those. That's fine. Uh, frigates. Uh, destroyers. Cruiser. 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 Ah, oh, that. Lots. <laughs> right. Uh, what's happening over here? Have we made it yet? Oh, hello. Defensive pact... Invita oh, that's not us. Uh, the Rekthalaran Fire Tribes entered into a defensive pact with the Uverzanian Interstellar League. They will now defend each other against all foes. Okay, so these... These guys are kind of okay-ish, I think. These guys are... I mean, they're militarists. They're probably going to like us. Don't turn them off, just wreck them when you have enough a strong enough fleet and get their tech. I mean, maybe. Right, let's commence this invasion. This shouldn't take long either. Why should I say that? I haven't even seen what they've got. Um That's their home world. Right, I imagine this is probably Oh. This is not very well defended at all. <laughs> in comparison. Which is uh what have they built here? Temples. Nothing but temples. Okay, that's that's gonna be over very quickly. Um, because yes. Uh cannot land armies on an un oh that's that's the wrong place. That's a star. I was about to land a try and land an invasion force on a star. Uh usually can fight them toe to toe unless you focus his fleet power. I don't actually know what state the, um, wait, what? Okay. Uh, right. They invited them into a defensive pact and then immediately subjugated them. Isn't that going to mean that they're pretty big? Oh, yeah. The, the, the orcs are now probably the same threat as we are. Yeah. Hey there, goat people. Time to meet my giant robots. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Yeah, they just they just demanded their subjugation. Right, that's going to make the map look very different. Hang on, let's let's get this sorted out first. Here we come. Walking down the street. We're giant angry robots. We're fun to meet. Invasion begun. All right, let's have a look at this. Oh, oh, wow. <laughs> That's not going to take long. Bing! Nearly, nearly. And... Nearly. Kablamas! 
Nice. That's another planet to fix. That's a very good point, actually. Sky angry, invade the sun. Yeah. We only devastated it a little bit. Okay, it's an arid world, so... Uh, we're not going to want to populate it with hamsters. Uh, these are going to be all goat people, aren't they? Yes. Okay, what did I break? What have they got? They've got nothing but admin offices here. Uh, that's quite funny. Also, that was a gas giant you tried to invade. Oh, there you go. Your army general doesn't just use all the war forms right at the front. That's a good point. What's going on here? Corrupt administration. Stability minus 20. Okay. And luxuries distributed. Sure. Right, how many admin offices does one place really need? Jesus Christ. Um... Right, uh, I'm going to replace one of those with a... Oh, they've already got a precinct. Okay, that's cool. Uh, I'll replace one with a fortress. Singular. Uh, what else could we have? Hollow theatre. Yeah, not even a bad idea. Uh, what else? Hang on one second, I just need to check something. I'm gonna try and hit the aircraft with the arrow. Eat. I'm gonna be able to say my idea. Come on, come on, come oh, on, oh, come on. Oh, oh. Come on, come on. What? What? Yeah, yeah! yeah. <laughs> oh my god! That was. That was propelled to Earth by the force of a thousand suns. That was amazing. <laughs> oh my god. You actually like, sped the animation up three times. Uh... Sorry about that, I heard some crashing and banging from downstairs. I was just double checking it was actually uh, my dad, so uh, I thought it was a good thing to check. Okay. Uh, Skibbity on the hollow displays, yeah. Uh, right, what do we got here? Uh, research, research, research? I don't know. Resource silos? Resource silos are never a bad idea. Uh, Hall of Judgment. Yeah, why not? Uh, okay. What's the worst could happen? It was a death metal washing machine. Yeah. That would be weird. Uh, okay, so that's their homeworld squished. Um, where is their big fleet? Okay, their big fleet is there. Hmm. The trouble is I'm worried about going too fast and then just coming up behind me and just stealing everything back again, which would be kind of funny. Uh... Oh wow, 3,000? The Starbase has 3,000? That's a chunky Starbase. Oh, it's a Star Fortress. Oh wow, okay. Did I, did I upgrade that by accident or is my fleet just that powerful? Oh well. Do that as a feint. <laughs> it's a Star Fart, yes. The mighty Star Farts. Um... Okay. So all of their military is focused down here at the moment. Should I just keep going? I don't know. Or do I back up and take some of these some of these planets? That might be a crazy idea, mightn't it? Uh, enjoy your dinner, Math. Keep them occupied with needless expansion so they won't focus on your main force. Oh, what, you mean just, just, just ping all over the place? Hydrobius. That's quite funny. So what's the... So the gold outline was their home world. What's the blue outline? Or the blue chevrons? Oh, Sector Capitals. Oh, okay. Right, I'm going to double check I've got that on... Uh... 
Actually, I really need that to be set to evasive because that can't actually defend itself. Right. Um, I guess we just keep going then. Because we can. See if we can lure these guys into a fight and then they'll have no ships to speak of. I think. Right, hang on. There's a bunch of stuff happening. Uh... Did we decide to uplift these guys? No, we didn't. We just we just left that for now. Low stability, society research. Okay. Keep shaving away that front. Okay. Uh, auto curating vault. Okay, fleet command limit. Ecological adaptation. Allows us to terraform inhabited planets. Okay, that sounds fun. Uh yeah, why not? System survey complete. System survey? Oh, oh hello. Radio signals. What what is going on with Unar 3? Or the Unar system in general? Everything is happening there. I I don't understand an industrialized alien civilization experimenting with wireless transmissions oh okay basic aircraft okay sure uh wait where was that una which is uh i forget where is it i've lost it i've lost it also, terraform tomb worlds. That would be handy, uh, considering I accidentally created a tomb world due to poor management. Oh, there it is. There's Una. Oh, that's got a wormhole in it, too. Uh, are we not actually... We're not actively... We're just observing this place at the moment. Uh... Oh, it's the Haspalve. Right, okay. They've got to the machine age. Good to know. Uh, unemployment, low stability. We, well, yeah, I just invaded those guys, so there's no surprises. Oh, clearable blockers. Uh, ah, ruined district. Clear that. There we go. Was that it? Yep. Okay. Cool. Are they? Are they actually running away from us? I think they might be. Which is kind of funny. Yep, they're like, oh no. Hostile station engaged. Yeah, okay, that's a slightly bigger station than I was expecting, but I don't think that's gonna be a problem. Nope. Handled. Uh well I guess I may as well I may as well invade here as well then, hadn't I? <laughs> or do I just wanna keep taking their stations away? Because the thing is, if I don't take their stations away, they still own the system. Uh oh, wait a second. Uh are they are they attempting uh are they attempting a vicious outflank? No, I don't know where they've gone actually. We'll just keep going. Oh, hello. Uh was this the place we just took over? Yes it was, okay. Uh, let's do a temporary fix for that. Go right up the middle. Okay. So, uh... Actually, that, that's, that's an unexploited system, which is kind of funny. Take out their resources and the ability to resupply. Okay, right. So we'll just, we'll just keep cracking. I want to know where that big fleet went, though. I'm waiting for that to try and get behind me or something, which would be bad. Onwards. Because uh, at, a, at a wild guess, if I try and take over, if I colonize a bunch of places all at once, I'm going to overstretch myself and then bad things will happen. That's, that's what I'm guessing. 
because their fleet is now fucked. That's a good point. How big was this? Oh, 1.5k, and it's not even actually rebuilt yet. Hostile station engaged. Okay. That's another one. Uh, 1k, no, that's fine. I should probably put some defenses in here, actually. That wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, oh, I can't. Because... This is an anchorage, not a... F Why would you... I don't understand. Why is this not a ship... Well, I suppose we're building shipyards everywhere. Oh, it's under occupation. Right, never mind. I'm... I'm getting ahead of myself. Not a problem, CT Gaming. Don't worry. We do We do not have a, a uh, attendance record. That's not a problem. But welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Overstretch will only be a problem when the war ends. Okay. Yeah, well, sometimes I need all the help I can get on this, so... Right, I can't upgrade this because uh, I guess we're... We haven't officially stolen that yet. Blocker cleared. Uh... Do we take this one and I didn't notice? Yes, we've just taken that one too. Okay, going well. I want to know where that big fleet is, because like, that needs to get squished. Uh, I think we're at cat. Uh, oh, hang on. I've just noticed we've got a consumer goods deficit. Uh, what have I done there? Probably because of uh, rapid expansion, I guess. Officially stolen. Civil asset forfeiture. <laughs> yeah, exactly. We need more chocolate factories. Right, yes. Uh, uh, right, let's have a look at our... Uh, let's see what space we've got here. Uh, oh, yeah, do you actually have some space on the Great Wheel for a chocolate factory? I don't think there are any chocolate factories here, actually. No, there aren't. Right. Uh, now, it's... Um... Oh, God, which one is it? It is... That one? Civilian Industries. Consumer Goods. Yay. Uh, oh god, what's going on here? We're looking after a lot of annoying goats. Yeah, that's that's probably it. They're like, Matt! Matt! <laughs> and my hamster's just like, God, why do we do this to ourselves? Why? Why? Oh, I don't have an option here. Why well, don't I have an option for Chocolate Factory? That's a lot of kids. I see what you did there. Uh, am I going blind or can I not see the option for it here? I've already built one. So I have. I can actually upgrade this one. Funnily enough, if I wanted to. Uh... Civilian fabricators. Uh, yeah, so I'll fucking upgrade that one. Yeah, makes sense. Uh, don't have one here. Uh, wait, hang on. Civilian industries. There we go. Uh, oh well, that's a... Wait, hang on. Ah, we can fix some of these now. There we go, that helps. We must make more iPods! Oh wow, this court, this, this, this place hasn't even been looked at yet, dear god. More iPods, more shoes! More shoe pods! Um, right, hopefully that'll help. Right, where's the, uh, where's, where's my war? Okay, uh, so, can we actually put, can we, is this still building itself? Okay, that's still rebuilding itself. Okay, so why can't I, 
Not possible while the starbase is under occupation. So does it have to fully fix itself and then I can build a defense system on it? I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, I actually, I honestly actually looked at the amount of time I've spent in game now. It's actually something like 50 hours. Uh, no, 35 hours. And I'm kind of like, oh my god. <laughs> uh, right, that's fixing itself, so that's good. Right, uh, where shall we go? So where does this, where does the... So this, their space actually reaches all the way down here. Okay, interesting. Uh, shall I just... I could go and knock out this thing as well. This, I wonder if this is where their big fleet is. Maybe I should go hunting their big fleet. Or just press on. I don't know. Let's just press on. Because we can come around here, take that one. I don't know where their main capital is. Have they lost their main capital? I don't know. Also, there's a big hole here. I'm slightly worried about that. Why is there a hole? We don't know. Bruce will be able to command his own fleet. <laughs> 309. Here we go again. Engaged. And got it. <laughs> oh wow, that's um yeah. Let's let's have a look at our, our ridiculous giant fleet here. Look at the state of this. It's a miracle they don't actually crash into each other. Or maybe they do. Maybe that's the maybe that's the uh the secret of their powers. Oh, now you see, I can build defenses here. That's interesting. Why couldn't I build defenses on the other one? That's weird. Oh, because... Wait. Oh, they didn't have a colony. I see. If they have a colony there, I can't build defense platforms. Got it. Uh, the hole is always fine and there's something to worry about. Is Phoenix still kicking about? Uh, uh, let me have a look at leaders. Uh, he was... Oh, I've just noticed we can hire extra people. I didn't realize this. Holy crap. Uh, yes, he is actually, uh... Oh, he, he actually just helped us liberate uh, this planet. So he's a busy boy. I've just noticed we've actually got, uh, uh, we actually got a higher uh, leader cap, so we need to hire some people. make the fleet look more orderly and be proper sized. Oh wow, okay. That's, that's that's something to look forward to. Liberate. Yeah, exactly, liberate. Uh, right, so let's hire an official. Uh, who, who are you after, Rogebergle? What have we got here? Galactic reforms? Leader trait. Principled. Oh wait! I can hire a goat person! He's Brock, son of Gab. I only just noticed he's actually he's he's actually a goat person. Is he a goatarian or is he is he a uh, he's a goatarian? We can we can hire a goatarian as one of our officials. That's that's too funny not to pass up. Ah, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna hire him. All right, he costs he costs more than anyone else, but fuck it, it'll be funny. Right, uh, commanders. Right, I'm not hiring a military one of these. That's a terrible idea. Uh, Brock, son of Bok. Okay, what does he do? Uh, leader trait. He's got resilience. He's got uh, military fleet ethics. What? Negligence? We don't want him. That's a terrible idea. Right, that's a Brock son of Bok. Didn't I lose an election to some other species? Yes! Uh, we did briefly. 
Um, but uh, I, I remedied the situation. Right, will this fit? Duke. Bruce. The Mogul. Son of Approach. There we go. Oh, nearly! Ah, oh, we're one letter like, we're one letter off. We ran out of uh, ran out of letters there. Okay, Bruce Mogul. Oh, this is very silly. Excellent. And spare scientist. Right, what else we got? Fura, son of Jark. Yeah, why not? I have goats. If you don't make him an army commander, the shields and stuff won't matter. That is a good point, actually. Right, so actually we could... Uh, oh god, we could build a load of extra stuff, but I can't think right now. Ah, Right, okay. Uh, we're retaking this, so this is good. Right, we'll give it a little chance to fix itself. So what's the defense of this? That's 3,000. That's looking solid. System survey complete. Okay. Uh, oh, wait, what? Oh? Protector of the Wheel, Quinn, son of List, served the Empire for 102 years. Retired at the age of 30. Oh, wow. Okay, we need to hire somebody else as well then, apparently. That's another commander. Um... Yeah, it's annoying. This guy is only... Uh, oh, actually, no. He's okay as a counselor, because he actually makes cru uh, he makes cruisers cheaper. What about this one? He's just got a good lifespan, but he's a, uh, a, he's a goat. I mean, technically, these are citizens now, aren't they? They are, they are friends. Because they're goatarians. Yeah, to be honest, that's actually... That doesn't sound too bad. So, hold on. Let's have a look. Uh, what are our options here? Experience gain. Butcher! Ah, yes! This was the person I was going to put in charge. So, uh... Oh, no, it's army effects. I was going to put them in charge of the transport fleet. I should do that. I should do that. Uh, dock sheep... Dock sheep. <laughs> dock sheep upkeep. No. Dock ship upkeep. That is different. Actually, that's that actually might be really good. Uh, because that's any ship that's stuck on a station. That actually might be quite handy. Um... Oh, that's military fleet effects. That's not empire effects. Okay. Right, so hang on a minute. Uh, Wait, one of those is in the red. What's wrong with them? Oh, it's asleep. Okay. We should really merge all the Cybrex fleets. That would that would probably be a smart move. No one here is going to send cheaper cruisers. Yeah, true. Right. Uh, okay, all my invasion fleets are a bit higgledy-piggledy here. Oh, these are these are regular hamsterians. Okay, right. I don't think we can merge. Right, hang on a minute. That's a Hot Wheel. Uh, you guys go there, and then merge those two. That would make sense. Time to build a thousand cruisers and blot out the galactic core with your ships. Yeah, basically. Uh, hey, Quinlist, uh, who, who did you want to rename? Sorry. Who is the Grand High Poobah? Uh, let me find out. It's, it's, uh, Dr. Oppenhamster. The, the immortal one. Apparently it's very good at running the Empire, apparently. Uh, did you want to rename the new, uh, military commander, Quinlist? 
you did luck out naming him. He got he got very uh He's very blessed. The algorithm was bl blessed him. The most corrupt politician I've got. Oh wow. Um Well, the only one we've actually got to available is well, he's a goat person. He's not actually very um Oh, galactic emissary? Oh, we should make him a galactic emissary. You can be Sin Quinn of List, a Galactic Emissary. How's that? Sin of Sin of Sin of the Goat List. <laughs> uh. Right, we need to, we need to make you our Galactic Representative because apparently you're really good at that. Uh, Galactic Community Emissary effects. Yeah, okay, hold fine. Uh. There we go. That gives us uh, strength on galactic market, galactic reforms, crisis declaration, and change galactic focus. <laughs> yeah, nice. I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, right. Okay. What was happening? Many things are happening. Right. It's gone six o'clock. I need to. Uh, I need to have a break. Brain reaching overload. Uh, so I'm gonna take about a ten minute break. Give or take. Um, care for yourselves a drink, have a stretch. Uh, I might lay down on the floor and breathe deeply for a couple of minutes just to get my brain back in gear. I don't know. But I should be back in about 10 minutes or so. So I'll catch you after that. Good. All right, we are back. Um, yes. Okay. Uh, I've just found the big fleet. The big fleet is there. Though I don't think it can stand a much of our uh, much of a problem, but we'll find out. Uh, hopefully, it won't go after our stuff here because that would be very embarrassing. Um, though I do actually have some fleets here. Okay. Oh, that's the weirdly advanced cruiser which we just left floating around by itself. That's rather unfortunate. It's because we couldn't actually make that part of its own fleet because we don't know what the ship design is. That's kind of funny. Have I got any defense things here? Oh, I've got the amoebas. I've got the amoebas there. That shouldn't be a problem. If they go into that system, the amoebas will probably have them. We will give them to the amoebas. Right, okay. Um, I guess we keep going. I guess we kind of need to head in that direction. But that is actually quite far away because of how the uh, planets and stuff are lined up. But okay. Uh, right, I guess we just go over here and take this one next, that makes sense. And also, weirdly, apparently these need to be upgraded. I don't know why, but I'm not going to do that right now, because, uh, we're in the middle of conducting an invasion, so, you know. Cleared. Oh, that's good. Uh, we're still quite low on the whole consumer goods things, but we are having abundance of food. Uh, we could do with selling some food to buy some consumer goods. That would be an idea, wouldn't it? Let's sell 10,000 food and let's buy... Uh... I don't know. 2,500? There you go. I'll go buy some time anyway. It'll be fine, probably. Evading hostile fleet. Oh, they did do that. Cheeky bastards. Now, you see, I'm out of position now. Ooh, cheeky. They sent their big fleet. I have been viciously outflanked. Because now that's actually going to take me a while to loop around, loop back around and get them. Wait, hang on a minute. I should have a fleet being built over somewhere. Where was that other fleet being built? Was it here? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. This could be painful. Because... Oh, except... Uh, are the space amoebas actually... Oh, wait! Are the space amoebas gonna fight? I don't know. Station under attack. Oh, the space amoebas got, like, crushed. Uh, that's unfortunate. Spaceport lost. Uh, that's that's not good. Uh, 
Wait, where are you guys going? Are you guys... Why are you guys going that way? Is that the fastest route? I've made a terrible mistake! <sighs> a minor setback. I mean, sort of. The thing is, if I had any ships near... Uh, near here... I could send them through the gate, but I don't think I've got any spares. Oh, that's very not good. Right, how, how well defended is this? Not very. I've utterly failed to upgrade my defences here. This is not smart. Oh dear. Research complete. Okay, that's gonna be a that's gonna be that's gonna get crushed immediately. Oh, that's the weirdly advanced cruiser. No, that's gonna be on its own. Send send it send it away. Oh god, no. Churn out a vet for float till it bloody slowed down. Detected. Yeah, it's true. It's going to take us some time to get back there. I was kind of hoping, honestly, that these space amoebas would put up slightly more of a fight, but apparently they didn't. Hey, Webber! <coughs> How's it going? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Uh, let's make sure I've got his name right. I have! There we go. So, uh, Wabber is a top chap. Uh, he's also part of the uh, Chaos Collab that we're doing on Tuesdays as well. So welcome in. Epoch! Ooh, I don't think I'm familiar with that one. Uh, breaking Amoeba badge. Yeah, basically. But I hope you had fun with your stream. Welcome in, everybody. Hope you're all doing well. Um, ooh, antimatter missiles. That sounds fun. RPG kind of like Diablo. Ah, okay. Lots of putting your uh, left mouse button in peril, basically. I, I, I understand. Oh, this has not gone well. <sighs> this will be fine. Right, the really funny thing is, uh, where's the nearest gate? Because I could get people here quickly. Not a problem, I know what it's like. Hello, meow. Welcome, welcome. Thank you very much for the follow as well. Hope you're doing well. Okay, these guys actually took some damage, so this this might work out. We might be able to hold them up. Uh, let's see if we can get some defenses built in the meantime. That might be an idea, if they've actually stopped. I utterly failed to put any defenses anywhere. Which probably didn't help much. Whether they'll be built in time is another question. Or whether they'll slow them down in time is also another question. Oh, look at that! Our consumer goods is now plus 81. That's perfect. I think this is all they have. That is literally all they have. Which means we can we can handle it. I mean, maybe, to be honest, maybe I should just start coming up behind them and wrecking their own stuff as I go, but I don't want them to run roughshod over my... Uh, over my galaxy while I'm at it, to be honest. I mean, that's a good point. Surely, actually, it would be smarter if I came in behind them and then they'd have to make a choice about defending their own stuff and taking mine that might actually be a smarter move yeah actually thinking about it let's do that because i don't think they can actually cause a huge amount of damage with luck relic activation can we afford it 1600 that's getting expensive now uh, are we still building those? That's the important question. Uh... Oh, uh... I think we've only actually got one in the queue. Hang on. Oh no, I got two in the queue. Uh... Hang on. Uh, 
hang on, I thought we could actually make, I thought we could make like, uh, what should I call it? Um, robot, uh, assault things on top of the Cybrex, but maybe not. Oh wait, hang on, how do you do a, how do you do a stack of five, is it, no, is it shift? Oh, because there's no robot pops. Ah, oh, that makes sense. Starbase. Army planet on a starbase. Oh! Aha! Okay, right. Well, I'm going to get some more of these on the pop anyway, because... Mind you, that's getting very expensive with Unity. How much is that? Sixty. That's that's a lot. Oh, actually, it's the minerals that are that are costing it. Fuck it. I thought the star bases were only for ships, though. I thought you had to get the ground attack stuff off the planets. Right, are we, are, we, are we building stuff? Okay, that's good. That's up there. That's good. That's gonna help. Oh, that's made that much scarier already. Right, okay. It's quite possible we've just doorstepped these guys. Right, so if I could find some robot pop... Uh, oh, what's this? Rare resources. Rare crystals. Oh, we're not getting any rare crystals coming in. I can only assume that was coming from somewhere else. Right, hang on a minute then. Uh, where are we? Da, 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 da. Oh, army builder! Ah! So we can actually have we can have Yuri. No, no, no! I want to see what they are. Were they are they any good? I don't know. Uh, Gotarians, Yurian, and Hamsterians. Okay, right. So we haven't actually got uh robots yet, or at least not in that world. Oh, it's control for five at a time. Right, I knew it was one. I knew it was one of them. I couldn't remember which. Okay, I think we we've because I think this is literally we've stopped them right there, uh, which is good. Why is that red? I got a bunch of stuff just sitting around doing absolutely nothing. Uh. Might be an idea to re add some more to that fleet. That's that's sitting on the Cybrex war ring thing, but I don't know. Yeah, you see, they've stopped all of a sudden because suddenly my defensive my defenses here have suddenly become much better. Right. Okay, now what does that look like? Uh, we should probably see if we can merge the fleets. Actually, that would be a smart move, wouldn't it? Uh we can't merge the fleets because they're all too different. I imagine. We can probably merge... Hostile fleet detected. Yeah, okay, where's that? No, no, no. Where? Where's the hostile fleet? That's my own fleet. Oh, no, that's not my own fleet. That's an invasion fleet. That's an invasion fleet! Oh, hello! Uh, uh, but that's defenseless. That actually can't defend itself, so that's okay. That's fine. Well, that's not a problem. So I'm not too worried about. Also, the, the it's not actually very strong, so that's fine. <laughs> yeah, they got they got that far. That's as far as they got. Right. Okay. Hostile station engaged. Yeah. Meanwhile, we'll just keep nicking their stuff from them because it's funny. Like so. Enemy troops landing. Uh, we failed to fend off. Oh wait, what? You what, Missus? Is that a that? Oh, they took it back. They have. They took it back. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. So you could say they've taken the piss. 
<laughs> yeah, I didn't actually, I didn't fortify that properly. That was the problem. Uh, wait, what's this guy doing here? Is he just... Or is that the main fleet? No, that is the main fleet. Okay, right, cool. Uh, go here next. We're just going to keep taking their stuff. Right, okay. We've we fortified that a little bit, so that'd be hard push now. Uh, I'm sure we were building another fleet, weren't we? Because I can build lots of things. That's not the fleet. Oh, no, wait. I'm thinking about the uh, shipyard. Uh, yeah, here we go. Um, that's only a thousand, though. If I accidentally moved them already, that's only two cruisers. Okay, I've accidentally moved them uh, already. That's not quite what I meant to do, but that's okay. That's another two cruisers that can go down here. Yeah, here we go. Right. Hostile station engaged. How's this gonna pan out? This shouldn't work. Fleet destroyed. Yeah, okay, maybe it might work. I can't see them. Where are they? Station lost. God damn it! Okay, they're at 1.4k. That's okay. That's not so great. Maybe I should have. Right, they're only they're only now at a thousand now, so that's good. Charge for the conclave. Yeah, I know. Retake the piss planet. It is stronger than it looks. Yeah. I'm. I think I'm gonna catch them up. The. Uh... I'm just going to keep going. I'm just going to keep taking the systems. Baseport lost. Oh, man. Oh, shut up, Wasserian Desolators. You're just not even remotely important. Oh, yeah, hang on a minute. Wait, 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 wait. What's, what's happened here? Uh... Oh, God. Wait. Uh... Yeah, wow. Okay. Yeah, they had they had more fleet than I thought they did. And in fact, where's my Oh shit, they've just taken that one as well. Which I thought I just reinforced. Yeah, no, that's 3000. That's actually quite scary. Uh yeah, we're in a bit of trouble now cuz I can't get my fleets in the right place. Oh no. Yeah, I've got one big fleet and it's completely in the wrong place. That's bad. This is very bad. Uh, I thought that station would be strong enough to resist that, but it wasn't. Ah, uh, shit. Hmm. Right, what's next then? All right, luckily I actually thought ahead and I, was, I started building defenses there, so that's good. Uh, can you guys get there. That might actually help. Oh no, they'd have to go through there. This is this is going a bit wonky. I need to build more ships. I should have built, like, several big fleets rather than just, like, a big fleet. Oh, this is not good. Yeah, that is basically like their entire military might down there though. It's it's that is that is basically all they've got as far as I can tell. Right. Cuz the funny thing is much as they're doing that over here, I'm doing exactly the same thing to them over here. Oh, are you still invading there? Uh no, why aren't you moving then? Oh, you are moving. There we go. Insidious plot uncovered. Hello. Yeah, I do. I do need some sort of border patrol. You're very right. I thought my stations would would hold up to that more, but apparently they didn't. Okay. Uh, we have no exact details. Of their apparent scheme, manipulation of our existing relationships, undermining agreements of trust in our very way of life. Hamsterian? Okay, that's fine. Unity gained. The event implicated in a plot happens in one day. Okay, this should be funny. Right, we can adopt a new tradition. Uh, Maybe we should do the uh, Starbase 
defense thing. Uh, never surrender. Uh, uh, that sounds good. Yeah, I put a couple of... I, I did actually start putting some defense upgrades in for the uh, star bases, but I didn't do it quite in time. Oh, I'm going to go with this. Right. Uh, the, the... Gun batteries and torpedo batteries. Yeah, I've got I've got defenses. I've got defense platforms. Or do we mean things here? Oh, because I haven't upgraded it to a starport. Oh yeah, probably not. Yeah, I haven't upgraded that. <laughs> that, that that's a, that that'd be why. That'd be why. Right, where did they go? Is that it? Are they is that are they happy with that? Apparently they're happy with that. Okay, maybe they've stopped because they've noticed I'm actually like uh coming at them from behind, so let's let's hope that's the case. Hostile stationed engaged. Okay, that's fine. That should be a one-legged man last kicking contest. Hey World Saber, how's it going? Oh, I need to pause this quick. Dear, dear god. Welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing very well. Uh, what were you up to? Raid! Yes, thank you very much. Much appreciated. Conan Exiles! Ah, do I have ever played that myself? I played uh, Conan Age of Brown for a bit, but that's, that's all I did. Uh, which was kind of okay to begin with. <laughs> Right, have I got this? Oh, I have. Okay, can we merge these now? Yes, we can. And then we put them under command of our butcher person. Hee <laughs> And then we have a horrible invasion fleet I can do horrible invasion fleet things with. Yes! Okay, good. Oh, what are you doing there? What are you doing there? Uh... No, 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 I'm trying to consolidate my forces. Oh, you're just passing through the system. Okay, that's fine. That's fine, Hostile you can pass through the system. Engaged. Oh, I accidentally engaged the station. Whoops, okay, right, how good is it? Uh, terrible. By all means, engage the station. We'll take it back. Hostile station engaged. Okay, we're, we're, we're pincering these little bastards now. We've, we've got them on the run now. This is good. Uh, right, how well defended is this? It's not defended at all. We got him on the run. Only mild panic. Handled. Construction complete. Uh, uh, defenses? Yeah, oh, that seems good. This is fine. Organization, what is it really? It's at a nebula, you can't see into the system. Ah, okay. Hostile station engaged. Hostile station uh, rapidly eliminated. Handled. Next. <laughs> oh my god, there's a great big glowy thing over here. I assume that was the aforementioned nebula thing. <laughs> the aforementioned nebula thing. No, no, I wish to click on the station. There we go. Oh, wow, that can have nine? Oh, wow, okay. Build more, build more. More build. Hostile fleet detected. Oh, he's come back again. Right, how big are they now? 3,000. Okay, uh, you get there. Right, how hefty is this? It's not very hefty because we just took it back. Oh boy. 
Yeah, he's going to have a decision to make fairly soon. It's like, does he keep pushing into my territory or is he trying to defend his own? Research complete. Okay, what have we got? Uh, wormhole travel. Hey! Uh, I don't know how that's going to be benefit us right this instant, but we'll find out. Gravitic sensors, listening post, hyperdrive 3 networked movement. That sounds fun. Let's have some of that. Don't touch those worms, I know. So there were a couple of wormholes floating around. Does that mean I can mess with them now? It says unexplored natural wormhole. I'm sure I had one of these. So there's one here. Can I actually explore that now? Is that a... Can I Can I do things with it? Oh, that's a gateway. Not a wormhole. Um, 131 months, yeah. With a science ship. Oh, okay, right. Now, I know we had a couple of those hanging around. Uh, I keep getting that confused with the gateway symbol. Like, there's one, but that's, like, all the way over there, so that's not going to help me much. That's a... Why have I not reactivated that gateway? That would have been a really smart move. Uh... I can totally afford that now. Actually, yeah, that would have been a smart idea, wouldn't it? Um, I'm sure we had an unexplored wormhole. More locally than that. There was like a couple of them. Oh, I've lost control of my... Uh, lost control of my mouse. There's another one there. That's an enemy territory. Oh, there we go. Unexplored natural wormhole. Right, okay. Is that in the middle of the combat zone? No. Okay. Let's find a sleepy science ship. Where's the nearest science ship? There. Uh, unfortunately, that's going to involve going through enemy territory, I think. Or is it? No! We can go that way. Nice. Uh. Oh! Extra Satan has retired at the age of 143. Great, i gotta, uh, I got to hire somebody now. Uh, that's another official. Okay, what have we got? Log, son of jerk. Planet governor, sector governor. Uh, galactic emissary. Oh, when you support a resolution that passes in this category, you gain one... F That's very specific. Let's hire him. Right, okay. Uh, we're getting there, right? Oh, yeah, handled. Yep, go there, take that system. Yeah, we're catching these guys up now. We're catching them up. Uh, that's 1,000. Fat screw it. We could have a couple more of those. And then we might be able to catch them between that and the uh, thingy-bob. And uh, then they'll be in a bad way. Who's this? Is this mine? Well, that is mine. Covered in amoebas. That's the amoeba homeworld. That's why no one's messed with it. <laughs> I just suddenly realized that. I was like, why didn't they go over there? Uh, compelling reasons. Right, we have actually almost cut their empire in half, which is uh, quite funny. Right. Uh, are you are you exploding stuff? Hostile station engaged. Yeah. G give it give it a couple of seconds. Space Handled. Under attack. Oh, hello. Spaceport under attack. Whoop, 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 whoop. Right. Now. Where's the invading force? 4,000? Uh, this could be very bad. Yeah. Okay. We'll have to see how this goes. I think they might do horrible things. Oh, God. Naval activity in Abrez. Significant reports within the Istran Reavers. Oh no. Don't tell me the Istran are about to kick off. That would be unfortunate. Where are they? Uh, where are the Istran Reavers? Oh, they're there. Yeah, it's suspiciously close to our borders because we're destroying we're destroying the uh, bloody um goat people one. Right, okay. This, this, we might lose this one. Uh, it's not looking great. 
it's no oh, uh, no no not good not good not the mama we'll catch him we'll catch him eventually in fact what we may as well do is just like rock up here let's see if we can cut them off that's an idea spaceport lost yeah i thought that might happen fleet destroyed yeah that that those fleets are much scarier than our stuff can you hire mercenaries? I don't know. Okay, these guys don't actually appear to be much scarier than us. They just have more of them. Right, where's that other fleet I was building? That's a thousand. That's not big enough yet. This is fine. This is fine. I think. Planetary Revolt. Oh. Great. Uh, that's one of the places I took over, I'm guessing. Uh, rebellious elements of populace seeking to overthrow our rule, which is here? Oh yeah, that was one of the places we nicked. Okay, maintain current measures. The approach will have no effect. Distribute amenities. We could do that. Institute a crackdown. Distribute amenities? The rebellion is arriving. They are revolting. I could distribute some amenities. Or I could do a crackdown. <laughs> Army build speed plus 50. Stronghold build speed plus 50. And is this because I don't have enough people here? Okay, let's do distribute amenities. See where they are on the map. And if they're oh wait, hang on. I've got like I've got like an entire like posse of people here. Uh we do have a precinct. I mean, is there something I could do? I can't like send over them over there to sort of like pacify them, I suppose. I don't know. System survey complete. Right, where is where is the Death Fleet? Uh, the Death Fleet is there. Okay, still at three thousand. That is not. That honestly is. They are surprisingly resilient. All right, are you moving? You are moving. Right, yes. Intercept these bastards before they get rid of us. Oh god, damn it! Terrorist action. Great. Land the army on the planet, that'll help. Okay. <laughs> and then suddenly, 4,000... What is it? No, what have we got? 4,000's worth of cybernetic organisms landed on the planet. And they suddenly rethought the entire thing. Uh... Finisher effects, which is clear independence from the Hamsterian Conclave. Okay. So this did nothing. So how how do I fix this? I've landed my army on there. I've landed a massive army on there. I mean how? I don't know what else the, there's not I mean the planet actually isn't in that bad a state other than the whole, you know, rebellion thing. It does have a corrupt administration. It doesn't matter if they rebel. Okay. Research complete. Oh wait, they've actually disappeared. So does that mean they're now... Wait, where did they go? Oh, they just sat there. Oh, okay, there we go. Need housing and jobs. Uh, we got here admin offices, resource silos, hollow theaters. Uh, hey, Kurzov, some leaders that can give extra job slot on your planet. Uh, 
Maybe. Uh, planetary defense armies plus one. <laughs> that might be a good idea. Um, uh, empire effects, no. Yeah, I'll tell you what, let's let's do that. Screw it, let's put this guy in charge because he, he makes armies go better. Uh, oh, okay, that's as many city districts as I can build, apparently. Uh, yeah, they have a massive deficit in consumer goods. Would it be an idea it turns consumer goods into unity? Yeah, but you're not actually producing any consumer goods, so that's a problem. Uh, relic activation. Here we are again. Oh, God. Uh, 18. We're probably going to have to give up on this at some point, because I'm running out of minerals. <laughs> We've got quite a few Cybrex wandering around, to be honest. Uh, I still think we're building them there. How many have we got there? A few. One. <laughs> right. Okay. Let's let's just catch up with Captain Grumpy Draws here. Right, okay, I'm going to try and... I, we might actually be able to intercept them. If I intercept them with this and they crush it, I will not be happy. I will not be impressed. Oh god, there's lots of things happening. Um, climbed projects, that's debris, not too worried about that. Uh, resource storage full. Uh, minor artifacts. Oh yeah, we could do uh, do things about this, can't we? Secrets of the Cybrex. Oh, issue special project. Delve into the secrets of the Cybrex. Why not? That sounds fun. That sounds great fun. <laughs> what could go wrong? Nothing. Right, come on. Come on, you guys. Go get him. Go get him. How long is it going to take? 70 days. Counting down. Going to be about a minute or so. Then our borders will be mostly safe, I think. Maybe. Here we go. Oh, they they ran away. They ran away! Cheeky little gits. Right, are they better defended here? Not by much. Right. I'm sure I was building a bigger fleet somewhere. Oh yeah, here's another fleet. That's good. Got another one. Take back the urinal. Yes. Uh, Where was that? I've forgotten where that was, to be honest. Stenborg. Ah, oh, okay. I will eventually. I'm more concerned on... Here we are. I'm more concerned on taking this fleet out. Right, that says 5,000. That's not true. There's more of them than that. That's only that's only the fleet on the top. Hostile right, this should engaged. work. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, that's what it looks like when you're on the receiving end. Yeah, exactly. That's quite enough out of you. Right. Where's my giant invasion fleet? Admittedly, my giant invasion fleet is now currently uh, <laughs> dealing with a bloody uh, rebellion at the moment, but I think we could probably spare some of them. No problem, Roach Mogul. Right. So how do I... It says embark all. Why don't I embark all? Yeah, I've got like a 7,000. I've got a fairly big garrison here anyway. Uh, is there like a, a filter thing or a... Ugh.
so how do I do that then? Oh, it just it just makes them pop out. Okay. That's that's even dairy, that's hamsterian. That's hamsterian. To be honest, the war forms were only like a thousand, I think. Uh, that's not. Oh, that's Cybrex. Okay, there's one. Oh, okay, it has the giant skull next to it. I should have should have noticed that. Oh wait, I didn't just disband all of those, did I? No, I didn't. There they are. Excellent. Right. <laughs> right, shoes on the other foot now. Right. Uh oh, I can't get there for some reason. Why can't I get there? They need a general too. Oh yeah, hang on, let's put a let's put the butcher in charge. Why can't they get there? Huh. That's interesting. Oh! Have I not blown up the station yet? No, the station's gone. Oh, it's because I haven't taken it over yet. I think. No, but they won't go here, either. See? It says... They, they won't go there either. Oh, the wormhole in Una has been explored. It connects to the Abrez system. If I knew where Abrez was, uh, that'd be great. Um, I'm not sure where that is. Uh, oh, is it because they have to go through hostile territory? I think it's because they have to go through hostile territory and they can't actually defend themselves. That's probably it. So what I might need to do... Hey, Kermify! Is take this system over so they can go the long way? Is that what's happening? Can I... what about here? No, they won't move. Why won't they move? There's no reason they... Oh, they can go there for some... Okay, I don't know what's going on. I've been lurking. Ah, no problem. Click on the wormhole, see where it comes out. Okay. Yeah, I don't... I don't... Oh, wait, there's another fleet there? How have they generated another fleet so quick? That's some bullshit. Let's get rid of that too. Right, wormhole. Oh, great! That's where the fucking Reavers are. That's not good. So I've just opened a wormhole in Unar, which... Does that mean... If the Reavers... Uh, if the Reavers know how to operate wormholes, does that mean they could come straight through? That's bad. That's a problematic wormhole. Yeah, great. Goody goody gumdrops. Okay, this is fine. Right. I want to try and resolve this bloody situation. Right, please crush these people. I'm kind of sick of them running away from me. It's really annoying. Oh, what's that? Uh, that's relic activation, which we chose not to do. Resolution has been passed. Comfort the fallen. Okay, sure. Uh, repeal. Repeal cooperative research channels. No. Uh, oppose. Time to start fortifying the world thing. 
close the screen door you're letting the xenophobes in. I know, they're bloody everywhere. I need like a bug zapper. God, it's honestly, it's really hard to pin down. I mean, I've done a terrible job of organizing myself, but it's a, it's a tricky, it's a tricky way of trying to sort of like, like the, the, the fighting the war front thing is a problem. <laughs> I'm, I'm not good with that. Oh, wait, I own these systems anyway. Maybe I could send this lot. This lot isn't very big, but we could go fight over that that way. That shouldn't be a problem, because I th honestly think this is all their fleets. Honestly, man, Unar has been a nightmare situation. Oh, hello. Commercial Pact Invitation. The human star hegemony, who literally have one planet, uh... Entered a commercial pact with the pious Locken theocracy. Sure. Why not? Uh, where'd that fleet go? That fucking fleet fucked off again. Hostile station engaged. God damn it. Hostile fleet engaged. So I don't know where that fleet went. Did it do did it do the magic teleport thing again? Because that's really bloody annoying. I think their entire fleet is in Stenbock. Well, I don't think so, because it... I don't think we destroyed it. Or did we? No. That was only that was only their, their transport fleet. They literally just fucked off. Left or right? Yeah, I guess. We'll have to go looking for it, otherwise that's gonna that's gonna bug us in perpetuity. Uh oh that's another wormhole. Uh Uh what's that going on? Yep, commercial packs, we combat Yeah, all I did was destroy the science ship and the transport the invasion fleet. That's all I destroyed. God damn it. Okay, right. Are you are you actually doing anything? Oh, it's paused. I'm like, nothing's happening. So that's because it's paused. Oh, that hostile station is bigger than I thought it was, but that's okay. Uh, it might not be okay, Space actually. Life form encountered. That's actually bigger than I thought it was. Uh, oops. Go, go help out. There you go. Oh, of course, it was my space station, wasn't it? That I upgraded with my stuff. Uh, yeah, that's 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 not really doing an awful lot, apparently. Oh no, there we go. No, we're fine. Everything's fine. Oh, now the fleet's in the system. Yeah, everything. there we go. <laughs> Okay, right, we took that back. That's good. Right, let's grab you and head back over there. Right, where's my invasion fleet when it's at home? My space station. <laughs> uh, right, we probably need to reinforce a lot of things now, because uh, we broke them. Well, we didn't broke them, the enemy broke them. Spaceport under attack. Oh, fuck off, you're kidding me. Where? Where? It says spaceport under attack, but it does not tell me where. Also, I haven't got some engineering search to do. Uh, destroyer hulls, auto cannons. I've left auto cannons alone because everyone said auto cannons are rubbish. The army fleet in Bunda. Oh, maybe. Alloy mega forges. Robot modifications. Mega forges. That sounds fun. Uh, no, it's... Oh, there's an invasion fleet, I failed to notice. Yeah, that's an invasion fleet, I actually failed to notice. Uh, 
Right, where are you going? You look like you're moving. Have you just arrived? I think you just arrived. Oh, wait, why would they... Oh, God. It's all going wrong. Uh... No, this is all my stuff. I own this stuff. What's the... Oh, it's attacking the... There we go. Yeah, they're transport fleets. That's what it is. Yeah, I'm working on that. I've got my... I've got the... Uh, what's it? Uh, my in enormous invasion fleet of doom is on its way. If I can actually get there now. Yes, it can. Look at that, finally. Right. Complete. Okay. Uh, amusingly, we can keep pushing here, so I might as well do that. Uh, it looks like the rebellion is in reverse, so that's good. Uh, ecological adaptation. Okay, that works for me. Collective self. Shush. External leader pool size. Okay, we did that earlier, I think. Oh, ship build speed, ship upkeep. Yeah, I'll take that. Thanks. Don't mind if I do. Right, now we have too much consumer goods, which is hilarious. Um, But never mind. Right, what's happening now? No, nope, that's the wrong button. It keeps saying it keeps saying fleet under attack, and what it is, it's me absolutely crushing uh, a, a transport fleet. Right, let's see if I can reinforce this ship because this is just getting silly now. Uh, right, star base is under occupation. Right, so we can't do that right now. Uh, I really need to invade it. That's what I need. I need more invasions. Okay, I actually got a station engaged. I got another spare fleet floating around here, so that could just keep going. Go there and start breaking stuff. Uh that's good, that's good. Yep, that's not a problem. Oop. Oh dear. Oh dear. Uh that might be a crash. That's a crash. Oh no! Uh, never seen that happen before. Hmm. I have experienced my first crash. Oh, yep, no. Oh, that's very bad. Oh, dear. Yeah, Stellaris went splatty time. Oh, dear. <laughs> right, do bear with me, uh, dear viewer, as I uh, fire it back up again. Well, let's hope that saved that recently, because if not, there's an awful lot of things I need to do again. I'm assuming the bigger uh, uh, a... a uh, what's it? Um, thank you very much for the follow, Kurzov. Uh The bigger a galaxy get, the more unstable it gets, I guess. It's just a dragon break. <laughs> yeah. Something broke, that's for sure. Okay, let's see where that left us. Luckily, I know it does have auto saves, but I don't know where where we would be. Oh dear, that's not very steady either. That's a little bit wobbly. Um, uh, fairly recent. Oh, that's not. Ooh, does that look okay to you guys? Because that looks herky jerky to me. I haven't got something going on, like multiple instances of this, and going on in the background or something stupid. I don't think it's very happy, you know. We good now? Are we good? Okay, we're good. We're good, we're good. It's all good. Everything's funky. Right, so we're actually pretty much where we left off, so that's good. Uh, yes, because I was about to... I literally said, you go down here. And then I was telling this guy to keep going. Yep, yep, yep. We're good. We're good. We're okay. Right, note to self. Don't click on the thing where it says, uh, fight ongoing, because apparently it doesn't like it very much. Uh, we decided we couldn't afford this. Oh, minus 200 energy credits. What the hell? Monthly gain minus 200. 
ships, stations, star bases, armies. Fuck! Okay, that's not good. The later into the game, the laggier it gets. Go planet cracker or shield world. Oh, okay. Just a random crash could be anything. The minus should fix itself. I mean, let's hope so. I could sell some consumer goods, to be honest. Because we've got plenty of those. There you go, that keep that ticking over. Hostile right. station engaged. Right, now this is the right, I'm not clicking on this. I'm not clicking on anything, I'm letting it do the thing. Because what I did, I clicked on that and then it broke. Right. Victory. Yay. Oh, what's that? Uh, repairs completed. Oh, Noodle Strike Force. Okay, that's good. Right, okay. Uh, oh yeah, look at this. We have just, we have just carved their empire up quite a bit. This is good. This is good. Conan, what is best in life? Uh, right, you guys heading here? Yes! We're taking the galaxy back. Yes, right, I'm gonna have to put a manual save in. Galactic domination and cake! There we go. It will restart. Oh, it has! It's already fixed itself. There you go. Yeah, it's it's already it's already unfucked itself. It just it just had a moment. Hand crack paradox games were restarting them. Oh nice! Hostile fleet detected. Oh hello! Three thousand! Okay, that's where they went. Right, okay. It's it's chasing down these bastards again. It's so hard to pin down. Right. Get after him. Because that station won't last for two seconds. It's so annoying. They just, like, mystically teleport off somewhere and then they come back where I don't have any defences. It's kind of like, how the fuck am I supposed to catch the bastard things? It's really quite annoying. Are they not attacking? I mean, they probably should be very soon. Yeah, it's really irritating Space though. Under attack. Yeah, there's nothing I can do about that because they got behind me using magical Spaceborne abilities. Encountered. Spaceport lost. Yeah, see, there you go. They just they took that straight back. Ah, I don't like that. That's so. That's so dumb. So it's like they could just mystically disappear, reinforce, and then come back. And it's like, right, and and how am I supposed to stop that? It's so annoying. Uh, research agreement proposal: human star hegemony and the Lockens. Yeah, that's fine. We don't mind that. Because it's like, I have more than enough, like, fleet power to just crush them in one go, but I can't catch them. Uh, nice to see you playing it with Iron Man without being set to Iron Man. Oh, yeah, no, I'm, I'm, like, uh... Sort of, yeah, I, what, what, what did somebody call it the, the other day? Bron Bronze Man? Something like that? Uh, hey, the old chaos, how's it going? Spaceport lost. Yeah, this is so stupid. We're now just playing like exchange the spaceport because I can't reinforce fast enough to to Ah, it's so annoying. Wait, am I accidentally taking all of these ships on the way past? All these systems on the way past. I mean, I might be. Right, my invasion fleet is here. That's good. Yeah, it's kind of crappy, though. Uh, insidious plot uncovered. <laughs> oh, it's all starting to unravel. It's all starting to unravel. 
Our operatives in the Anthurian Dynastic Union have uncovered something credible hints that the Jackie Consciousness are plotting to deceive us. Great! We're gonna be fighting a war on two fronts at this rate. Okay, thanks slug people. Their loyalty changes by minus 30 and our opinion of the Consciousness changes by minus 80. Implicated in a plot. Uh, great. Yeah, but it's it's kind of crazy. It basically means that your, like, fleet power counts for nothing. Because providing they have one big fleet that can avoid all of your other fleets, they can just take what they like, and you can never catch them. It's, it's kind of a bit, like, eh. Don't like it. On the plus side, I'm gonna absolutely fucking take this planet back. Where is this planet that is mine again? Uh, there we are, the Urinal. Land those fucking armies. Actually, I best check what, what they've actually got for defensive first. Uh, 601, not much. Spaceport under attack. Uh, doesn't matter, because I can't do anything about it. Oh wait, hang on, I do actually have a, a... I said that, I do actually have a fleet right there. Right, let's see if we can pincer these fuckers. Oh, that's actually slowing them down. That's actually giving them pause. That's something. Wait, did they... Oh, they did take it back. Okay. Wackazino, yeah. Cool, planetary invasion. That's all good. This looks like this won't take very long. Handled. Oh my god! Uh, we paused. Secured. Okay, uh, they are the uh, Thalon Remnant. A stagnant ascendancy. Militant isol isolationists. Great, it's another fanatic xenophobes, because we haven't got enough of those. Jesus Christ, bicycles. Right. Oh, they're gold. Okay, it's the other fallen empire. Got it. <sighs> Okay, I'm going to be nice to them. Why not? They don't care. <sighs> okay, right. We've taken that back. That's good. Uh... Right, is that actually slowing him down? That is slowing them down. Okay, I wonder if it's going to slow them down enough that one of our fleets can catch them. Thank God I reinforced that spot. Jesus. Imminent situation. Planetary revolt. Uh, no, that says zero. So we should be okay. Just don't border them. I see. That's a fair point. So this looks good. We appear to have uh, stopped things. Oh, because it's cadet difficulty. That's why. <laughs> there you go. Anyone was wondering what difficulty we've got it on. We've got it on cadet. Right, okay, uh, so, yeah, this is quite funny, actually. So we've got, where is our big, big fleet? God, I'm losing track of, of stuff now, this is nuts. Wait, did I split my big, big fleet off? I did, that was a mistake. Spaceport lost. Uh, no, that's okay. Right, we've taken, we've taken Stenborg, so that's good. Oh no, I actually already had Stenborg. We've just taken there instead. Um, are they are they still going? Okay, that's actually giving them pause for thought. Uh, maybe. Oh no, wait, that's their station. That's absolutely nonsense. That's the reason they stopped there. It's their station. Shit. Right, you. What are you doing? Cancel order. Because you are not strong enough to take on them and the station at the same time. Uh. Right, okay. Ooh, okay, what have we got here? Bulwark of Harmony! While in a defensive war with another empire... Uh, ship build is increased, ship fire rate is increased by 15... That's a defensive war, which we're not in currently. 
Uh, starbase capacity, starbase upgrade cost. Hmm. I'm gonna go with that. Let's do that. Uh, invasion over. Good. Let's do that again. Oops, I did it again. Right. Uh, archaeological site discovered. Not too bothered about that right now. Right. What state of my stuff that's bordering it? Okay, that's 3,000. That's actually... That's actually... Moderately able to defend itself, despite the fact I haven't put any fucking platforms on it. That might be an idea. I sent in the war forms and killed everything. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I gotta say, I'm not a, I'm not really a big fan of the whole... The... The... The, the ship combat, sort of fleet combat thing, strikes me as, as possibly a relatively weak aspect, because it feels like... It feels like you're just flailing. Right, they've actually engaged us there. Okay, what does this look like? This This could hurt. 2.5 versus 2.9. Okay, they're probably going to wreck us. Uh, hello. Are you on passive? You shouldn't be passive. You should be on aggressive. There you go. That would make sense, wouldn't it? We'll be going back to Guild of Dungeoneering. Uh, not right now, I don't think, uh, Wolf Warrior. I've, I've kind of got very deep into Stellaris, uh, and then we're doing Helldivers, and we're doing Battletech on top. Um, at the moment, not not planning. Not saying never say never, but but not anytime soon, I don't think. It's a fun little game, though. Prime continues to be a problem on the Urinal. I literally just took it back. Ugh. I literally just took it back. Right, how's this fight going? Hostile station engaged. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, they destroyed the station and they're fucking ruining my fleet. Oh, I'm busy fighting a war. What is this fleet comp that they can just destroy stuff that's the same strength as theirs? I don't get it. Uh, it's because they flicked the planet. Hey, Meek Nix, how's it going? Fleet battles can be more dynamic. Yeah, it just feels like I'm chasing... I'm, I'm just chasing my own tail at the moment. Uh, Increase the benefits. That will sort that out for now. Yeah, this is... This is not... Okay, it's, it's we're putting a dent in them, but that's about destroyed. all we're doing. Yeah, that's destroyed that. That will then magically reinforce and start being bigger again. Oh, this is just crap. I can't catch them either. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. It just doesn't it doesn't feel very fun. Uh what's the colony? Right, new turbog. Go invade that. They get a flat bonus to fleet power because they're nutters. Oh, okay. Planetary invasion begun. Okay, that's good. That's my planetary invasion. Uh, yeah, right. Where are you guys going? Oh, you're you're heading that direction. Uh, yeah, I suppose they have to defend themselves, and that's fair enough. But it's kind of like. I, I, it's like if it was if it was a stand up fight, I'd steamroll them. But because it's not a stand up fight, I can never get there. It's just kind of annoying. Was it three purifiers? I think we had more than three purifiers. We had a lot of purifiers going on. Is what do we have? We have. Hang on, we had. Angry goat people here. The exterminators are there. We got the reavers right behind them. Um, we've got the desolators over here. It's it's yeah. It's it's interesting. Let's put it that way. Uh, invasion over. That's fine. Resource full. Uh, minerals are full. Okay.
All right, do we actually do we actually invade here? We did take it back. Okay, that's good. I probably need to start reinforcing stuff as I go. That would make sense, wouldn't it? I'm a xenophile in a galaxy of assholes. Yes, apparently. I'm a militarist xenophile, though. I go around giving very aggressive hugs. See, look, their their their, their fleet power's always already gone back up again. How do they regenerate their fleet power so quick? I'm like, what? Okay, let's let's fucking just go for it because actually, yeah, you guys, you guys, hang on a sec. Let's get this. Yeah, let's get the big boys in there. Oh, they're repairing the ships. Okay. Because if like if they, if, if they had more than one of these fleets, I would just be I would I would have probably been disappeared by now. Oh, now they're going to attack me from this angle where I have no defenses again, and I can't catch them up. Ah. Wait, are you guys moving? I oh, know you have no... One of you has some orders. Right, okay. How about both of you head over there? Council agenda ready. Uh... Evolving society. Uh, sure. Right, meanwhile, I could just random- where was that other random fleet I had that I was just taking stuff over with? Right, okay. So they don't have- oh god, they're all the way down here. Oh, that's their new sis- that's their new, uh, that's their new home world down there. I wonder if I could get down there. If I sent my invasion fleet over there. Just Corvettes. Uh, could do. Wait, who are these guys? What's the fourth star order? I don't know what's going on. Uh... So that's the. So they've relocated their home system there. Yeah, their empire is much bigger than I thought it was. I wonder if we can kind of like cut them off. Oh god, now what? Nope, that's still fine. Everything is fine. Yeah, see, there you go. Look, they've just, they've completely circumnavig circumvented stuff, and it's like, I've Space chased them all the way around the here, attack. and now they're there. And now I'm going to start losing systems over there. Because again, that's going to be the biggest fleet in the system, and then I'm now in the wrong place again. Ah. Spaceport lost. It's like playing tag, but with spaceships. It's really annoying. Yeah, honestly, what are these actually com I don't even know what these are comprised of. Right, Corvette, Destroyer, Cruiser, that's all they've got. It's eleven ships, and they're they're just I can't catch them. Special project complete. Oh, hello. Uh, integrate the Cybrex artifacts into our research process. The insights into megastructure engineering will greatly in increase our own. Oh, hello. Fungus Among Us gains the expertise Voidcraft. That sounds fun. Don't mind if I do. 11 ships on a pub crawl. Yeah, a very violent pub crawl. Admittedly, I now got I've now actually got more ships in system. So that's 
something. Right, what are our defenses? Oh, 7,000. Okay, I've made this... <laughs> This place has been well fortified, so that's something. That's why they probably stopped there and went, Ooh, maybe we shouldn't. Right, in which case... Uh, Space Storm Tabuk arrives. Uh, what the hell? Massive subspace disturbances... Da -da -da. five to ten years will play havoc with sub oh great now i'm not going to be able to catch them because of some interstellar bullshit storm excellent excellent space born life form encounter that's great i'm so happy right <sighs> hey chaplain backers how's it going they'll get more uh frequent as time goes on oh okay Right, on the plus side, I've actually reinforced some of my stations a bit better here, so that's something. Right, where are you guys going? Right, you guys have stopped there. That's good. Right. Uh, first satellite. Explorix? Uh, oh, it's the, uh, Zulokako. Okay, cool. Good for them. Right. What if we just start doing the same to them, and we just start n nicking their shit? That's what we're going to do. No, not that. I was clicking on that. Oh, God. No, I've just told them to cancel the order. Steal your planet. The beginning filter of the learning curve doesn't dissuade folks from playing. It's using the mid-game that follows up and filters out the weak-willed players. <laughs> I'm incredibly weak-willed. I know what it is, because it's probably, it's it's what I've done, I've taken a bunch of systems, and instead of actually, like, I don't know, um, reinforcing, my empire is so spread out in different places that I don't really have a proper border. Like, like, for example, like, I think if somebody decided to invade here, like, let's say somebody went nuts. Who are these people? Forceful Drone Expansion Initiative. Well, that sounds fun. Um, I'd probably just get wiped out, because I probably haven't fortified this place properly. That's that's probably what it is. Right, okay, this is good. I'm in system, and I'm, now I'm stealing their stuff. This is good. Hostile station engaged. Order restored on Evander Zun. The rebellion has been quashed. Excellent. Good, good to know. Got that handled. One fleet is in combat. That's fine. That's going to blow up as well. Space-born life form encountered. Uh, luckily, all of these are amoeba friends, so this is good. Uh, can we afford to activate the relic again? What was I short on? Minerals. Okay, I've got a shit ton of minerals. And yeah, we can afford that now. That's fine. Works for me. Okay, right. We're beginning to we're beginning to pin these buggers down now. So the annoying thing is though, I'm at star base capacity, which is kind of irritating. Five hundred minerals in a month. It, yeah, that's a good point. Oh, hello. Research agreement proposal. That's fine. Right, what are you doing? Oh, you're just sat there. Okay, right, this is another one of their sector capitals. Oh god, they are making... Whoever that is, they are making fast friends out there. I thought these guys were at war earlier, but apparently not. This is fine. All this too shall pass. Um... Right, where are you going? Nowhere in particular. Uh, we're cutting out advanced empires, allowing one falling empire, increasing difficulty, ensign. Oh, maybe. We'll see how it goes. 
Yeah, that's a good point. I I don't need to I don't really need to know about all the, the diplomacy that doesn't involve me. There there is that about it, but that's okay. Yeah, there's there's a lot of that going on. Yeah, the funny thing is, I wonder, could we... Oh, wait, hang on. Where'd their capital world go? Oh, wait, they've relocated their capital again. Uh, so that's... Oh, okay, he won't do that unless we've taken it over. Um, we could make a beeline for their capital, actually, because we've nearly, entirely by accident, um, almost cut their cut them off down here, so that could be funny. Should make my experience better, yeah. I have, I have expanded in the most higgledy-piggledy fashion you've ever seen. So hang on a minute. Where is... I'm sure. Trouble is, there's so much stuff on the screen now, I'm actually having great troubles keeping up with any of it. Where are my fleets? Uh, okay, I've got a fleet up there. Okay, good. Uh, that's going all over the fucking shop. What I need you to do is get down there. And then we could do a sneak attack down here. Oh wait, no, that's not linked. Uh, actually, go here instead. That works, and then we might be able to go through there and nick their capital, so let's see how that goes. This is like the third attempt I've tried to wiping these buggers out, and it still hasn't worked yet. <laughs> Bribed officials on the urinal. <laughs> That's the last thing you want to see. Oh, man. Okay. Um, lovely. Bribed officials. Great. It's minor stability again. Yeah, good. Great. Alright, here we go. Alright, now wait a second. Since when did I... How did I take this? I didn't even know I had this. I didn't even know I had this. That's really funny. Uh, unemployment or poverty. Oh, God. Right. I, I, I think I'm going to have to do some colony manage, management, annoyingly. The golden handshake has a new meaning. Yeah, exactly. Right, let's let's do a bit. Where's where's Wenkward? What's what's happened with it? How, how bad are we doing? Oh, there's four unemployed there. Oh, God. Uh, right. Uh, civilian industries. Uh, extra jobs. That sounds good. Uh... Uh, da, 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 da. what else? Um, we haven't actually got an alloy foundry here. I'll give you some jobs. Um, generator district, food district. Uh, there's some block. Oh, I can't clear those blockers. That's fine. Uh, oh, unemployment here as well. Oh god, we really need to do something with Gaia. Bloody hell. Um, agriculture. That's probably a good idea. Uh, I like they do hydroponics farms. There we go. Oh, can't build any more of those. Okay. Uh, robot assembly plants. Not on that world. They'd be very upset if we did that. There you go. Have some luxury residences. That should keep you happy. Spaceport lost. Yep, yeah, that's fine. That was in the middle of enemy territory. I don't really care. Oh my god. What is wrong with this place? I mean, aside from everything. Uh... Got a 
powered up precinct, got a fortress. Jobs. Always with jobs. What cannot be done. Oh, can't build that. Uh, housing amenities. Uh, let's do some. I'm going to put another precinct in there. Fuck it. Discourage growth and decisions. Uh, discourage planetary growth. It's got a pop. No, hang on. Uh, it's got a population of 57. That is big. Uh, disencourage planetary growth. Yeah, okay. Let's give that a crack. Oh! Okay, this is new. Oh, these are like a f the, oh god, this is something else as well. That's that's a that's a menu I didn't even know I had access to either. Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh wait, did I just do that on the wrong planet? Oh no no, that was that one. No, that was the right planet. There we go. Right. Okay. Uh, what was I doing? Right. I said I thought I sent a fleet down here. Did I not send a fleet? Oh, I did send a fleet. It's just taking forever. Right, you chill out there for a sec, and then we're going to do a cunning maneuver. Right, okay. Uh, you took that. That's good. Take that too. In fact, you know what? Fuck it. It has layers. Yeah, exactly. Many layers. Many layers. Okay. Uh, oh, there's a wormhole there. Maybe I should have a look at that wormhole. That might help out. Um. Oh, okay. What have we got here? That's a that's a relatively small fleet. But then if we start bracketing things, that'll be hilarious. Well, I've made their empire shrink. Let's put it that way. They are still going to exist to bug me to eternity, but they're still, you know, it's shrunk. Actually, I suppose the smart thing would be is to invite. Can I? Can I get here? Yeah, fuck it. Let's just invade there too. We'll invade everything. Uh oh, right. Traditions available. Bloody hell, that came around quick. I thought we already just did one. Uh, bulwark of harmony. Uh, I mean that's the last one we can do. So let's do that one. Which gives us a perk slot. Okay. Galactic Force Protection. Uh, that sounds fun. <laughs> More naval. Oh, when we went. The funny thing is, we are nowhere near our naval cap. This is the thing. This is probably something I should probably look into. Oh my god, there's a lot of this going on. Oh yeah, if the Jackley turn on me, that's going to be unfortunate. Uh, but rather amusing at the same time. Defender of the Galaxy. Uh, no. Interstellar Dominion. Eternal Vigilance. Oh! Starbase damage, starbase hull points, defense platform damage, defense platform cap, plus one commander capacity. That could be fun. Uh, Galactic Contender. Technological Ascendancy. Uh, executive Vigor, Transcendent Learning, Voidborn, Habitats, Habitats, Expansion. Honestly, right now I'm in the I'm in the mood to punch people in the face. So maybe internal vigilance might not be a bad idea. Kind of blows my mind you didn't take Tech Ascendancy. Ah, first run through. See, it was funny because because when I was playing it the first time, a lot of people were like, "Take this, it's essential," and other people were like, "It's naff," and I was like, "Ah." So you know, I I, I did a coin flip in my brain. Please punch me, Daddy. I oh, know that's not good. Right, are we uh, are we actually taking this system, or are we just are we just we're we just looking at it? Okay, good, we're taking it. That's good. Yeah, you you better fuck off, science vessel. Right, 
Has the has the magical fleet disappeared again? Yes, it has. Great. That's good to know. Magical fleet has disappeared. Oh, actually, we've got like a tiny little this tiny little island of these bastards, right? Can you can you divert? Oh, that's going to take exactly the same amount of time. Uh, let's, let's let's go sort that out. I should probably reinforce some of these. But we're going to keep pushing, because these bastards deserve it. Right, uh, let's keep going. I do have a massive invasion fleet on wherever it is. Uh, bloody... Ah! The place that's in rebellion right now. Can't remember the name of it. Yeah, I wonder if that, that's a good point. Maybe we should check in on the Jackley, actually. Uh, can we, can we, oh, the, the, oh, their loyalty is wavering. Yeesh. Can we improve relations? Brock, son of Tig. Yeah, you get on that. Wait, how is there? Oh, I see how it is. I see how it is. The, uh... The, the Jackie fleet power are now equivalent to ours. It is quite likely they could turn on us, at which point if they turn on us, we're probably hosed. Yeah, they've just been keeping themselves to themselves, and... Yeah. Yeah, they've got, they've got some... Oh, wow, yeah, no, they've got some chunk fleets. That actually has... They have a 10,000... They have a 10,000 strong fleet right there. Oh, it mostly made up of Corvettes. Should we have a look at their Corvettes? Blackfish class. Uh, They're not great, offensively, I guess, but still, that's a lot. Yeah, my, my, my secret to galactic expansion has been terrible. Oh, Jesus. Did Why did you go there? That's going to just result in you getting killed. Why did you do that? Did I tell them to do that? Maybe I told them to do it. I probably told them to do it. Okay, you're going to get back up. Oh, that's fine. Slow them down. That's fine. Hostile fleet detected. That's okay. Wait, is that transport fleet? Really? Where did that come from? Ah! Wait, so how come they can move? They can move their invasion fleets willy nilly, and I can't. Really? Okay. No, annoyingly, I don't have any actually offensive. Oh yes, I do. Oh, they're busy. Oh, they're heading in that direction anyway. How strong is that? Hostile station. Not very. Right. Okay. Uh. Wait. Hold. Hold. All right. I don't think you guys are going to get there in time, but never mind. We'll find out. Right. What is this clusterfuck? Right. This probably won't go our way. Fleet destroyed. Unsurprisingly, it didn't go our way. Incoming. Transmission. Uh, diplomatic proposal. <laughs> they want a peace office offer. Uh, status quo. Neither side currently occupies claimed territory belonging to the other. That's not strictly true. So they can fuck off. Uh, right, we've got high war exhaustion. Uh, low stability. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Uh, oh great, we've got bribed officials, c criminal underworld. Oh god, I'd need to fix this planet. Right, firstly, uh, replace that with a precinct. There we go, that might be an idea. That's, that's buggered. Uh, oh, we can repair it, that's handy. Uh, and probably upgrade the planetary administration. That might be a good start. They just span fortresses again. Yeah, exactly. 
yeah, if if the Jackley if the Jackley are like, oh, we're we're going to declare independence. That's they, yeah, that's peachy. That's fine. Oh, this colony is completely undefended. Okay, I see the problem. Wait, how come? Oh, they own that one. Wait, did they just take that one back while it wasn't looking? I don't know what's going on now. Right. Fleet destroyed. Yeah, no, that's no surprise. Right, you. Fucking go land your army there. Let's have that one. Right. Uh, did we reinforce that one? Uh, no, because we're in occupied territory. Cool, got it. Okay. The fanatic purifiers. When you take their systems, they swap to being your systems. Most wars don't do that. Okay. Have you had a break? Yes, I have indeed. Uh, I'll be wrapping up uh, probably about 20 minutes or so, give or take. Right, have I finally pinned these fuckers down? I think I might have done, you know? Research complete. Except planet they're gonna... Begun. Yep, there we go! Enemy planet secured. Yeah, that's enough out of you lot. Right, now, the question is, did they disappear somewhere? And will they come back to annoy the shit out of me at some point on a later date? Quite possibly. Um, right. The, I've got a random invasion fleet floating around. Uh, thank you for the hydrate, Rotomogel. Thank you for the stretch, Math. And thank you for the post check. Yeah, we did have our break at 20, at 20 past 6. Oh. Or thereabouts. Oh, there we go. Right. Uh, right. We just took that back. That's oh wow! Instantly, this th this is now okay. Yeah, let's reinforce that shit. Oh, we can have seventeen of those. Yeah, let's make that nice and chunky. Try stealing that one back, you assholes. Right. Okay. Don't know whether if that fleet like magically disappeared again. I I'm not sure. Maybe it did. Maybe it didn't. Should I be taking over planets this quickly? Probably not. Uh, I don't think we can colonize there, so that's good. I was gonna say, yeah, surely they're actually running out of uh, they're running out of room now. I wonder if we can get down there and take their capital. Because that would mess them up. Or alternatively, we could. Uh, well, that's a sector capital. Right. I did have a bunch of spare fleet somewhere. Well, this guy's still bit. Oh, right, yeah, we've actually got one of their strongholds is literally in the middle of our thing. I should be building more ships! I've got the capacity to build so much ships. I should be doing that. Um, Shipyard, right. Okay, so this is, this is probably where we want them. Right, let's have a... Instead of randomly spamming stuff, let's have a think here. Uh, so I think I've been underdoing it on the frigates, because the frigates are the ones with the torpedoes, aren't they? If memory serves. Or were they? I think they were the ones with torpedoes. And then we have a shit ton of corvettes. Uh, bunch of destroyers. And then, oh no, one, two, three cruisers. Let's try that. Frigates and a Corvette fleet will be great at chasing stuff. Right, maybe that's what I need. Where's the next nearest starbase? Have I actually... This... Uh... Oh, apparently I can't build... Ah, because I haven't actually... Haven't actually built one yet. That's why it's not a starport yet. Uh, right, we could go somewhere else for this. Okay, I'm also over the starbase cap, which is kind of annoying. Um, right, uh, does this have a, this have a fleet yard? E nope, it does not. Oh, this is the one I took from them. And for some reason, they didn't build a shipyard in here. Okay. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Uh, 
I just saw that invasion fleet disappear. I don't know where it went. Uh, that's another wormhole. Eight, 8,000. Nice. Okay. Okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. Right. I'm sure I had more fleets than this. I know a couple of them probably died. Maybe I should check up on them. Uh, that's in the Cybrex. That's, that's around here somewhere. What the... I'm like, why have I got a fleet called Bollocks? And I realized that was that was tank hair. Also, I appear to have a colony that's just here. When did that happen? <laughs> How are these guys doing? But I didn't even know I had this. <laughs> oh my god, I'm amazed these guys haven't rebelled yet because there's 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 like there's nothing here. I did. I did name it, and I forgot it was there. Uh. Yeah, probably probably was last stream. Oh, hey, we got exotic gas refineries. That's cool. They've been just they've been just keeping their head down because they they're kind of like I don't know what this whole thing's going on here, but they do. Yeah, I was worried about... Oh, we've been... While I have not been paying attention, the, we've been surrounded by the Rakthalorans. Which, you know, luckily we're on okay terms with them. Uh, I should probably get that fleet somewhere uh, useful. That would be a great idea, wouldn't it? Also, I should probably see where these wormholes go. That might be a good idea. Where's, where's the nearest science ship when you need one? Okay, there's one. Uh, wait, I just lost the wormhole. Where did it go? Oh, it's there. All right. Let's see where that one goes. Right. Uh... Shall I just reverse and go after their capital? I think that might be a good idea. I'm going to do that. In fact, what I'm going to do is uh, go here. Not Oppenhamster. He is determined. Uh, yeah, we've had a few. We've had a few um, retirees already. Uh, what's that? That's an amoeba swarm. Okay, that's fine. We've got this tiny little island in in Jackley territory, which could be a problem. Right, invasion over. Yeah, we knew that. That's good. Right. Can we, uh... Oh, that's building torpedoes. That's good. That's fine. Uh... This doesn't have a shipyard either, but that's okay. That can defend itself. Right. Oh, hello. What's that? Resolution has passed. Pan-galactic recycling initiatives. Well, I didn't want that one to pass, but apparently it has. Yeah, because now the bloody Uruks have, like, twice the diplomatic weight that we do. Oh. Did I win yet? Uh, no, not yet, Mechfrog. No, we're, we're kind of, uh, uh, attempting to crush our enemies and see them driven before us. But it's taken a lot longer than I thought it would. <laughs> I'm probably now overstretched, uh, in trouble, uh, but, you know, aside from that. Are you winning, son? Yeah, exactly. This is something I didn't even look into. I've got no idea. Right, what else? Low stability. Still this place that's not happy, but that's okay. We're upgrading that. Uh, engineering research. Okay. Uh, mega engineering. Uh, quantum catapult? What's a quantum catapult? A linked cage of torsion lenses around the cell. Interstellar transportation. That sounds fun. Mega structure, nice. Advanced railgun, okay. Don't think we had the basic railgun, but that's okay. Uh, quantum missiles. We should probably see about upgrading our fleets, because that that if we've unlocked some crazy stuff and I haven't noticed, that could be quite funny. One way interstellar transportation. Oh, I see. Um, 
Mining subsidies, mine mineral purification. Cruiser hull? I'm gonna go with cruiser hull. Okay. Okay. Um Absolutely lost my train of thought. Wait, what's that? I want some sort of black hole. Okay. Okay, so we're building stuff there. That's good. Did we actually get around to fixing that other gate? I think we did, you know. Oh, hello. Uh, Dr. Freeham, son of Jerk, retired at the age of 143. Well, we're going to need a new scientist. Oh, God, we can have six commanders now. Bloody hell. Uh, what does that mean? Military fleet hull points. Oh, he's like unyielding. Okay, that sounds fun. Uh, okay. Shall I shall I hire a uh, hire a, rack, a, a a goat scientist? I think that'd be funny. I'm hiring a goat scientist. I've probably got all these ships just sitting around doing nothing at the moment. Right, are we are we dealing with this little outpost here? Company. I think we are. Oh, okay, something's been built. That's good. What was that? Uh, don't know, but it was probably important. Uh, that's fine. Migration, that's fine. Planet in revolt. That's not so good. Ah, uh, great. Planetary revolt again. They're taking the piss. Right. Uh, where's the? Let's upgrade that shit. Uh, where's the button for that? Where's the where's the panic button for that? There it is, found it. Okay, uh, distribute immunities. Right, what do we have in the way of standing armies there? I bet we don't have anybody there. Revolting planet, yeah, exactly. Uh... Yeah, it's not a massive garrison. Have I utterly left these guys? No, I was upgrading stuff. I am in the process of upgrading things. I just forget to do it. Uh... <laughs> I am working on it. I'm working on it. They're too impatient. That's the problem. Right. Uh, where is my giant fleet going? What did I send them to do? Uh, oh yeah, we were going to go after the capital, weren't we? Yeah. What are the chances they'll magically have another fleet spawn and come over here and kick my ass? Probably, knowing my luck. Or we'll suddenly end up making peace and then it turns out that, you know, we, we actually... <laughs> we have to give it all back. Right, let's make inroads, actually, because there's nothing down here. You shouldn't be revolting. It's fucking disgusting here. Why do you think we're revolting? Yeah, exactly. Wait, uh... So, hang on a minute. The... Wait, one of the places I picked up... Uh, we managed to stop the rebellion... Because we had a shit ton of troops there, didn't we? Where the hell was that? Uh... Was it Evon? I think it was Evon. But then, that's fucking miles away, isn't it? Because that was... Oh god, I'm actually forgetting where places are now. No, not a uh, colony. That's what I want. Yeah, they've got like a fucking 3,000 and something garrison there. So we can embark a few of those and send them over to what's-his-face, even though I think that's miles away. Uh, Stenborg. Which is... over there. Okay, it's not that miles away. Okay, okay. That works, that works. Okay. 
I have a dream! Alright. Uh, so let's see what we've got left here. Have I left some Cybrex here? No, I haven't left some Cybrex. Okay. Wait, 29, 29, 55, 55. Right, let's grab some of these guys. Oh. I can't, apparently. Uh, why not? I was able to do that last time. That's weird. Why can't I move? Oh, invader column. Right. Hold on. There we go. We're going to go and suppress the citizens. Help, help, I'm being suppressed. It's the Urinal Liberation Fleet. Oh, that's a defensive column. Uh, okay, nailed it. Right. Where are they? 1,000. Right, where's Stenborg? <laughs> to the urinal! <laughs> Everyone full nodly queue. Oh dear, right there. Research complete. Okay, what have we got? Uh ship build speed, ship upkeep, good. We like that. Uh Starbase cap plus two. Uh yeah, we could probably do with that to be honest. Deep Space Black Sight. I mean, that sounds fun, too. Unity from factions plus 10. Or just very boring and go for stuff for, for, for it's cap. Um, governing Ethics Attraction. Oh, it's a Starbase building, which I'll probably just forget to do. Yeah, Starbase cap. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm thinking. Right, okay, what are you doing? You're coming there. You're the really big fleet. You're the tiny fleet. Right, tiny fleet, actually, go there. Big fleet, go there. This will be fine. Probably. Deep Space Black Sight is very situational. Oh, okay. Right, now i got to see how much I've got in the way of defences on the borders again, because if my... Extinctions are used to extract the minerals and strategic resources of the object they orbit. It's a bit late to tell me about mining stations, mate, honestly. Uh... Oh, okay. Uh, this has got nothing. Let's build a bunch of those. Uh... What about Durf? Durf. Oh, that's 3,000. That's not too bad. Uh, oh, I can have a few more things. That's good. Demolish some of the more inner star bases. I suppose I could, actually. Um, I think I did basically I put a star base on virtually everything. Um, which was probably not the best idea I had. Uh, so what do you do? Downgrade? Downgrade the star base back into an outpost. That is also a good point, actually. The Jackie might not be our friends. That's, that, that is fair. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll be okay. Probably. Maybe. I don't know. But that is a fair point, though. Uh, relic activation. Oh god, this has come round again. Uh, do, 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 do. what's it gonna cost? Uh, 20,000 minerals, and that's gonna give us 10,000 alloys. Fucking hell. Are we still building those? We're not building those. That's an oopsie. 
Uh, really should have been building those. Uh, da -da, there we go. I thought it was control click and you could do five. Shift click. No? Oh, I don't know. The Jackly end up being my downfall. Yeah, it's entirely possible. Yeah, this is getting more expensive as we go. Right, okay. Uh da, 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 da. right, I wanna squash this little squash this little green bit here. That'd be great. Wait, hang on, what have we got there? Uh are those the Cybrex ones? Oh yeah, with Incoming my transmission. with my butcher on it. Uh, don't tell me they they want to to offer peace. Get fucked. Uh, right. Uh, wait, how could you be traveling in two different directions at once? Oh, it's two different fleets. I knew that. <laughs> I was like, how does that work? Hostile station engaged. This is fine. Should not be a problem. And old. Okay. Uh, uh, oh, yep. Yeah, no, let's build a few of those. <laughs> overwhelm, steal, reinforce, overwhelm. Right, you keep up with those guys. Wait, no, wait, hang on. Are you... Oh, wait, no, not you. Uh, yes, you. You keep up with those guys. You can also queue a route like that. Oh, interesting. Okay, we took... We took your regular... Your regular... La, 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 la. Taking no chances this time. I'm putting... Loading up with stuff. Hostile station. The Istran Reavers are now insulting us. That's fine. I don't care. You're not my problem right now. Okay, that's another one. This is working. This is working. That space storm is annoying as fuck. Yeah, where was it? Uh, Jesus, it was... Is it this one? No. Yeah, I forget, but one of the planets, every time you click on it, it's like, boom, bashed explosions, boom. I'm like, ah! Yeah, it's not great. Uh, low stability, that's okay. We're sending some armies in that direction, so that that's, that's probably going to help, maybe. Or not. Uh, you're coming to sort out that wormhole, so that's good. Ah, that's already going backwards. Excellent. It's randomized which system it's in. Oh, okay. But yeah, I'm definitely with Bamboozle on that one. That was loud as hell. Also, things don't advance when you're paused. Two hundred eighty-five. Yeah, here's another one. Boom! Rumble, rumble, boom! Good lord. Hostile station engaged. Hostile station whooped. Uh, Senate is now in session. Repeal cooperative research channels. Uh, I think everyone's. Oh wait, am I supporting this? No, I'm opposing this. Why does it say I'm supporting it then? Oh, it means oh well that's not gonna that's gonna that's not gonna work anyway, is it? Because these bastards have nearly seven thousand diplomacy, so that sucks. Oh it's the thing being voted on, that makes sense. 
Right, we've stolen that one too. Uh, reinforce, reinforce, reinforce. <laughs> oh, come on. Let's keep it going. I want to get rid of that planetary capital, and then I'll probably wrap up after that. It's a matter of principle now. Unless they have like another 6 billion fleet powered star vessel appear out of nowhere. Which is entirely possible. Uh... Ah! God fucking damn it! I didn't want to cease fire! Ah! Uh... Well, we have crushed the rebellion on the urinal, so that's good. Fucking that close. I was that close to shit canning their planetary capital. Or their gal galaxy capital. Okay, interestingly, they have. Oh. Oh. I've just noticed the Reavers are actually kicking their shit. Because these systems were... Oh. Oh dear. We may have just exchanged one problem for another. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think I have a funny feeling the Reavers are going to do my job for me. Oh, God. Yeah. Still, I mean, we've expanded our empire by quite a a, a large amount. Uh, I guess I should probably, like, you know, sort out all the things that are going wrong with the rest of my colonies. That might be an idea, might it? Uh, all right, what was I say? Clearable blockers. Okay, let's get rid of those then. Oh, well, that's one there. Right, what's the problem here? Uh, unemployment. Okay, I'm sure we can fix that. Or something like that. I don't know. So what's the deal with the jungle planet and Helldivers 2? Uh, I don't quite know what you mean, PM Collector Boy. Yeah, it's probably about two hours worth of admin to sort out after that. Yeah, that's a good point. Space admin. Okay. Did that go? That worked. Okay. Yeah, so this is this is a absolute mess. However, I now have a what is effectively a second empire stuck in the middle with the Jackley, who are probably gonna betray me, but there we go. Uh luckily I didn't have anyone in their territory either, because otherwise they'd have been yeeted into the void, so I suppose that's a small bonus. Hamster's brain is jam. I would second that motion. Right, so let's quit out of there. Oh, Malevolent Creek. Oh, they fought for weeks there at no avail. Yeah, it's become like some sort of great big meme or something, but I'm not super... Uh, that's the wrong screen. I'm not super familiar with, to be honest. But we're going to wrap things up there, because it is late and I need to get my dinner on, as I always do. Thank you, Kurzov and Meow, for the follows, and thank you very much... Wabalabalam and Wild Saber for the raids. That's much appreciated. Um, as always, you can find my assorted links uh, there. Um, I am having... What's that gif? Uh, animated hamster gif that I found somewhere. I, I I don't know who it is, but nobody sued me for it yet, so, you know. Um, uh, yeah, so this week's a little bit different. Uh, I'm uh, not streaming tomorrow, because uh, I've got some housework to do, because it's Thursday. Uh, we will be doing Battletech on Friday. So not Saturday. We're, we're doing Battletech on Friday. Um, and then I'm having the weekend off because I've got some family commitments over the weekend. So there we are. So uh, all remains to do is uh, to go and raid somebody. Who shall we raid? Um, let's have a look. Cornish. 
HBFT Pacific Drive. Not sure about that one. That's a fairly new one. Um, let's, let's go right HBFT. Let's do that. Make sure I got his channel thing right. There we go. Let's put his channel in the... Uh, yeah, Chaplin backers. Yep, I'm all down with that. We'll put his link there in the chat. Uh, he's a lovely chap. So please be kind when you raid. Uh, yeah, I'm off to sort out dinner and then probably fall over. Take care of yourselves, and I shall catch you guys next time. Bye-bye.